It's time to play Oblivion. Let's get gaming. I'm excited to play. I didn't get to game much yesterday because I had to clean my room. As you'll notice, last stream I had a huge pile of clothes on the ground. They're gone. I washed them. This shirt, haven't worn in days. Well, probably in weeks because it was dirty. I washed it. Got clean socks, finally. I was reusing my socks because I didn't do my laundry for a long time. I got fresh socks today. Feels great. Life is good. I'm ready to game. I'm clean. I'm ready to game. Yeah, I didn't get to play RimWorld yesterday. I really wanted to. The new RimWorld DLC came out, and it looks cool. I didn't get to see too much of it, but it looks it looks interesting. I downloaded it. That's about it. I bought myself a $300 laser printer. I haven't had any problems yet. I, like, genuinely... I don't even know what a laser printer is. Like, what's the difference between a laser printer and a normal printer? Because, like, what it... You know, you might sell me on it. Maybe I want a laser printer. Okay. Um, let me recap what we did last... Last stream. Last stream, I became the hero of Kavach. I finally freed Kavach. You can't see it because it's over that mountain. It's actually pretty far from here. Pretty far north. I actually think it's that way. But I did finally save Kavach. It's fucking awesome. I kind of want to go back to Kavach to see if they're like going to rebuild it or if it's just going to stay broken forever. I don't know if they had the... <laughs> I don't know what the technology was like in games it's you. back then. Hi. When this game came out, it could be could, could a city be rebuilt in game as you're playing? I don't know. It'd be cool if it could. It just fully changes up. <clears throat> but I need to choose a new quest line to do. I was thinking we have I have a lot of options for quest lines we could do, like storylines, but there's two that I really want to do. We could do the pilgrimage. Um let me see where that one is. The pilgrimage. Uh, basically, I think that this pilgrimage quest is obviously I make a pilgrimage to all the all the shrines of the nine gods, and then it's to stop some guy named Umaril who's working with like a Daedric princess named Meridia. I don't know exactly what they're doing. They're they're fucking shit up. They're gonna do something bad, but we could save save everyone from that. I really want to do that one. Um, I also want to do the Mages Guild. I have to go to every town and, like, get accepted and a recommendation from every Mage Guild. Like, I do want to do that because it, it'll make me go to every town. I haven't been to every town yet. Um, so yeah, I was kind of thinking we'd do the Mages Guild to start. I would like to be a, you know, top-level mage. <coughs> Hello, see. Gotta go back to work. Bye, Michael. Hope you have a good day at work. <clears throat> Hi, Moose. I missed last Oblivion stream. How far are you? How far are you into the main quest? Um, the last thing I did for the main quest is I saved Martin from Kavach, the city that was burning down. I saved I saved him from that, and I brought him to the. It was like the Blades Temple. It was. Something like Skyhaven Temple. I think that's the one in Skyrim, but it's like the same kind of thing. Some kind of temple high up on a mountain where the blades live. And Martin's gonna stay there. He's gonna be safe. Um, and I have to get the amulet back for him. The amulet of the... Or the king's amulet. That's what it's called. The king's amulet was stolen. And I gotta get it back. But I don't want to do that just yet. I really regretted doing the main quest too quickly on Skyrim. <clears throat> so I want to... I want to kind of like do other storylines first in this game. I don't want to finish the main quest too quick. I'm scared to finish it too fast. Just making sure I got... Got all my stuff ready. It's a vamp. Hope today has been great. Thanks, dude. I hope your day's been great too. My day's been okay. I haven't done much like today. <coughs> Quest in the house to the left, in the town. Do you mean the fighters guild? I haven't. Uh, I haven't dipped my toes in the fighters guild yet. 
I don't even know what they're all about. I guess I could go in the house. I don't even know if I'd want to join the Fighters Guild. I'm more of a... That's oh, kind of a cool How building. I like the Mages Guild. I want to... I swear that when I, I want to be in the Mages Guild. Last night, I heard someone scream from inside. Hello. So in She's Join the pretty. Fighters Guild? Fight and get paid for it. <laughs> kind of already get paid to fight when I sell people's loot. <laughs> hey, Lonzi, thanks for a thousand bits. What the heck? I don't know if you knew this, but there's actually a sequel for this called Skyrim. Doubt you played it. <laughs> you should try it. It'll probably take you one to two days, 100% it. <laughs> Nope, never heard of it. I bet that bet that game goes hard though. <laughs> One to two days, a hundred percent it, imagine. <laughs> I wonder what like the speed run time would be to like actually 100 percent Skyrim. Like with no, you know, no glitching or whatever, no cheating. Okay, we have to go to a different town. So I got a, I already got my mage guild recommendation from this town, so we gotta go to a different one. Let's look at the map. What's the next town over? I guess Kavach is there, but I don't I don't think they're gonna have a mage guild. Skin grad. I did the skin grad mage guild. Coral. We should go to Coral. Choral, Coral. We should go there. I do wanna check on Kavach first. Let's just take a little look. Damn, that moon looks nice right now. I'm taking a picture. Beautiful. <laughs> do you see Steam is having a Fallout sale? Oh, is it? Cause it is it because of the show? That's cool. I'll have to look at it. I don't know if I have any Fallout games right now. I want to play them. I actually wanted to do the Fallout series after um after we're done with Elder Scrolls. Not like right away, cause I do want to play like Elden Ring and stuff, but um. Pretty soon after Elder Scrolls, I wanted to do the whole Fallout series. I feel sad because everyone's talking about the show and I'm missing out on it because I really want to watch it. But um, I don't want to watch it until I play the games. I know the show's like its own standalone thing, but uh, it's just the way my brain works. I don't want like any spoilers for what the universe, I guess, is like in the games. I don't even know what the games are about. I, I've never really look, looked into Fallout at all. Um. So, I don't want to watch this show yet. <clears throat> There's a DLC that you'd really like. You haven't paid attention to the quest, just pointing that out. In this game? I, I do have a lot of quests I've like randomly gotten. And I'll probably look through them and do them at some point, but... You know, I want to join the Mages Guild properly first. The reason I really want to join the Mages Guild is because I think you have to like get, you know, the top rank, like with all the recommendations to go into the library, the arcane library. And I really want to go in the arcane library. I'd love a fucking library. So I got to earn my place, got to earn my damn rank. New Vegas is top tier, three is good too. New Vegas is like quite a bit older, right? I was thinking that'd be the one I would start with just cause um, well, cause I live in Vegas. So I thought a good place to start for Fallout. <coughs> three came out first. Huh. So is there, <laughs> is there no Fallout 1? I'm confused. <laughs> or do you just mean 3 came out before New Vegas, but obviously 3 is not the first one. I think that was just worded funly. What is it, citizen? Fallout 1 and 2 are overhead roleplay game, not FPS game. Okay. Interesting. It's cool that they... It's cool that they took a different route, I guess, like mid-series, and then I assume once they took a different route, like it popped off. Also, sorry, I, I missed a lot of messages. Um, I saw a video of um, Hayao Miyazaki reacting to AI art, and I think it's very sad. I think more people should watch that video and see for themselves. Off topic, I know. 
Yeah, I'm not a fan of AI art. I'm not a fan of AI art when it's like passed off as like, you know, something someone put work into and like drew themselves. But I think like, if you're just like fucking around, I don't, I don't see too much of a problem with it. I do think it's fun to mess around with. Holy shit, that's an expensive weapon. I think I left this on the ground last time. Now I can sell it for a million gold. <clears throat> oh, Bethesda bought the IP and made and turned it to Fallout 3. Okay. Oh, that's cool. I didn't know that. Fallout 3 is better than New Vegas. Ooh, I don't know if everyone's gonna agree with you on that. I've heard New Vegas is the game that I've nonstop heard good things about always. Like when it comes to Fallout. Oh, so you know, subjective. I believe you that you like three more. I don't know what I'd like more. I I don't know anything about the games, but like, just my bias says I'm probably gonna like New Vegas more only because I live in Vegas. I used to live near Detroit, Michigan, but like in Canada, but like pretty close to Detroit. Like I grew up going to Detroit a lot. Like that was like the biggest city near where I grew up, even though it was in the States. Well, everyone's talking about the smell right now in game. <laughs> um, Detroit was like the biggest city near me growing up. And so when I played Deus Ex Human Revolution, it takes place in Detroit. And I think that was a big reason why that was my favorite game for a long time. Cause like, you know, you could see in game real life landmarks that you saw in real life. And it's just a cool feeling. Like it makes it so immersive. Um, There's nothing left. That's not true, we could rebuild it. I saved it for a reason. You closed the gate. Only quality goods for sale what? here. She has the worst prices it? imaginable. This weapon is said it was worth two thousand, and she only wants to give me two hundred. I'm not selling Peace it to her. Now I have to carry it with Rock me, and it's finished. like almost a hundred pounds. She's just poor. <laughs> Damn, I'm yelling at her for being poor. That's fucked up of me. <sighs> Morrowind has better graphics than Skyrim. I don't know what Morrowind looks like. I haven't seen it, but um, <laughs> I find that hard to believe. But I will say. Like, Oblivion's a little bit older than Skyrim, and I love the graphics in Oblivion. But I love the graphics in Skyrim as well. I think there's just a charm to them, even if they're, like, older. Like, this game, obviously the graphics are quite older looking, but I think they look really good. They're just, like, very... I don't know. They stick to a style, and I think it looks good. Damn, the city's still fucked up. I was hoping... I was hoping they'd rebuild it by now. <laughs> I don't launch a game for 24 hours. I expect the game to keep going while it's turned off and everything rebuilds. You have my trouble? No trouble. Carry no on. No trouble. I like how all the bodies are still here. <laughs> From every like all the all the Atronac bodies and everything. Woohoo! I got blessed. I got blessed today. Yep, nothing's changed. I guess the city's, uh... This is not gonna be rebuilt for a fucking while. Have I ever modded Bethesda games? Um, I mean, like, I had a couple mods on Skyrim, but very, very minimal. I would like to try like a really heavily, whoa, my game just skipped. A really heavily modded playthrough of Skyrim just to see what what could be done with it. I wanna try the AI NPCs mod where like you talk to the NPCs with your voice and they respond to you. I think that'd be so fun to try, but I'm afraid I'd get too immersed. I'm afraid I'd, I'd uh, get too invested.
All right, well, Kavacha stuff fucked up. Let's go get my Mage's Guild recommendation. <laughs> um, I think we should go to Coral. Chor Choral. I don't know how you say that. Oops. Let's walk there. I have, I've never walked like through the forest here. Let's see what the heck we find. Going northeast. <laughs> Jimmy, I'm leaving you for the guard from Whiterun. <laughs> he understands me. Dude, today Jimmy called me weird. Granted, I was definitely doing something weird. Um, but he was like a little bit too weirded out by it. I have this new thing where I've never liked perfume, ever. I was never a perfume person. Oh shit, I'm carrying too much. I've never been a perfume person, but recently I have gone like addicted to sniffing perfume. I, I have it right here on my desk. I've been using it as like a smelling salt. Like I just sit here and I just, I, I just like to sniff it. And I swear to God, it makes me better at games. Like when I play Counter-Strike, I'm sniffing it between rounds and it makes me play better. I'm not even joking. Um. It smells really good. And he thinks it's really, really weird. Like, concerningly weird. It is not like that I'd be doing that. He keeps telling me to stop, like, for real. He <laughs> thinks it's really weird. <laughs> it's actually just gasoline. Yeah. It's not even perfume. <laughs> Which perfume is it? Um, it smells like ice cream. Like, it's... It's called Yum Pistachio Gelato, and it smells like... It smells like vanilla ice cream. Like, it just smells really good. I don't know. It smells really fucking good, and I'd just be using that shit as a smelling salt. I really like it. Oh! I'm fucking this bear up right now. Full of shit. I can't even... I can't loot anything right now because that Warhammer I picked up is weighing too much. It's ruining my life. I had a boss that carried a big sharpie around to sniff, really? <laughs> Dude, I respect that. I respect that immensely. They don't give a damn. I like that they don't give a damn, you know? They like the smell. They're not gonna let anyone stop them from smelling it. I know how to actually kill trolls now. I know kill them with fire. I've learned. <laughs> so what do you do to be better at Counter-Strike? Well, you know, I practice 10 hours a day, and you? Oh, I sniff my perfume! <laughs> yup, and it works. It fucking works. Hey, it's a little... A little village here. Oh my god, I hope they have a shop here so badly. I need to sell my my weapon. Oh, it's just a farm. Just a humble little farm. Let's see if they let me in. Oh! I've entered what appears to be a recently abandoned farmhouse. Perhaps if I search around, I may find a clue as to the owner's whereabouts. Okay. I could investigate, I guess. Need a torch. Hmm. Let's investigate. Well, let's put some stuff away real quick. Since I can't carry so much. It is so fucking heavy in my inventory right now. I put away one singular potato, <laughs> hoping it makes a difference. Eh, whatever. It definitely is the weapon. I need to sell it, but I can't. <laughs> I, I refuse to sell for 200 gold. I know it's worth so much more. I'm taking these torches. They don't weigh anything. Hmm. I'm not finding much to investigate right now. I 
Am I gonna go all the way back to Elder Scrolls Arena? Um, I mean, I, from what it sounds like, that, that game sounds really fucking old. Some people have called it- oops, I didn't mean to do that. Some people have called that one, like, unplayable, but I'd be willing to try it. I'd definitely be willing to give it a try. Oh, a little, a little journal in the bowl, okay. I've come across a discarded page from a journal of a slight sarin, sarin guy in an abandoned farmhouse near the ruins of Kibach. Mentioned some sort of pilgrimage to bring an offering of great value to something called the Sunken One. All signs point to Sandstone Cavern nearby. I should proceed there as I fear for Slythe's safety. Alright, as midnight approaches, I still watch the fires burn. The great city of man, Kavach, lay in ruins. They didn't heed my words, they didn't listen to my voice. Now they're all paying the cost of ignorance. The sunken one strikes swift and hard. He swats those who oppose him as if they did not exist at all. The excuses of man fall upon deaf ears. The sunken one has no pity, he has no mercy. He only sits below and passes sentence. And now with a mighty stroke, he's toppled one of man's pitiful blights on his land. And yet he still hungers, his appetite is voracious. Kavach will not be the last city to fall by his hand. The world of man grows more and more corrupt and it angers him. Man's lies and deceit will be his undoing as the sunken one grows impatient and no longer waits for the... No longer waits or accepts the proper offering. The burden is mine to shoulder. I'm the last one who knows of he who shakes the ground. If I do not bring him the offering, who knows what city may fall prey to his whim? Anvil, coral, perhaps he'll turn his eyes on the great spoil of all. The great imperial city itself. No, I must not let that happen. I must get the offering to him like my father did before me. Man may be fallen in his eyes, but they must have time to learn the sunken one's teaching. Destroying man now would be a waste, when I am certain that given the chance they'll come to see his ways. Yes, I will do this thing, I will brave the depths of Sandstone Cavern to see him. My weapons will be my will and my word. The sunken one will watch over me and guide me. I must depart soon before it is too late. If anyone finds this page, let them know that I, Slythe Staring Guy, do this for the good of all man. What a good fucking guy, what the heck? Oh my god, thank, thank you for your service, Slife. Should probably go save him, but I mean, thank you for your service also. I hope he's got some good ass weapons with him. I definitely need to go sell my weapon though before we could go to any sort of cavern. I'm almost like tempted to fast travel. I think I will. Just to anvil and then back here. Cause I just, I need this weapon out of my inventory. It weighs a hundred pounds. <laughs> just very quickly. My horse. Uh, can't stay long, but I want to pop in and say I appreciate you're actually reading the books. A lot of players don't. They miss out on how the books contribute to the Oblivy vibes. <laughs> Hail. Yeah, I, I love the books. It's actually one of my favorite parts what? of um, this Have game in Skyrim. I like I'm all sure. the extra context you get from reading them. It's, it really does add to like the immersion, for sure. I ap Let me take a look at what you've got. Here my sword, please. Nice. Bye. Am I saving money for anything cool? Uh, gambling. <laughs> we gotta gamble it away at the arena. It's gonna be worth it. Are you gonna love Morrowind then? Has a lot of books. Good. A lot of the books in Oblivion so far have been books I've already read in Skyrim. I think it's a lot of repeat books. Um, I'm sure I'll find a lot more unique ones so as we play i'm hoping the arcane library once we join the mage guild for real will have some shit for me but i have found some new books too i i actually have a few in my inventory that i haven't read yet like the origin of the mages guild i want to read that and all the mythic dawn ones i want to read those too we didn't read all of them yet only the first one but um i'm waiting till we continue with the main quest to read all of these um I want to do like other quests right now instead of the main quests because I, I said this earlier, but I rushed the main quest in Skyrim and I was, I regretted that I 
I didn't like mean to rush it. I didn't know that I was rushing it. Holy crap, what the fuck? I didn't know I was rushing it. It just, you know, I was following it because I thought it was interesting and then ended up completing it before I completed almost anything else in the game. Um, ooh, money. So I definitely don't want to finish the main quest too quickly in this one. Did I learn to read Daedric? No, <laughs> I do not know how to read Daedric. I don't think I've come across a lot of Daedric books either. Floating is a skooma addict, that's what the money is for. <laughs> yeah, the, the gambling is actually a front. What the fuck? Who are we in battle with? <gasps> what the fuck is that thing? Oh, it's, it's an alien! It literally looks like an alien from the movie Alien. What the fuck? Holy shit, and a minotaur? I didn't know they had fucking aliens in this game. Holy fuck, and that's a lot of minotaurs. This is fucked up for me. <laughs> I don't like this at all. That one's glowing! Dude, my armor is so fucking good. I feel I'm like barely taking any damage from these guys. Okay, I'm, I spoke too soon. <laughs> Take a little bit of damage, but not that much, to be honest. like almost tank him for a little bit. Before I couldn't tank anything, I would just have to run really fast. Oh. But I could tank a little bit now. Oh god. <gasps> okay, they're fucking me up a little bit. I quick sniff the perfume for a combat boost. You're right, that's a good idea. Let me, let me spray it on myself a little bit so I could just keep smelling it. I fucking swear it helps me play better. It's not cope at all. Like it actually helps. That's crazy. I was like, I'm just gonna drink a potion. A little, it's a little magic going. Oh my god. There's so many of them! Oh my god, where am I even walking right now? God, dude, he's like staggering the heck out of me. Health potion. Yes. Gold diamond ring. body somewhere. Did I forget what mods I have installed? No, I just don't have any. <laughs> Ooh, dwarf and more hammer. I don't have any. I thought I had the, the patch downloaded. Well, I do have it downloaded, but I don't have it installed. I still didn't install it. I'm fucked in the head. <laughs> now that I'm not being attacked by a fucking alien, let me 
finish harvesting what I was trying to harvest before. Some goddamn vegetables going. This will help me. This will serve me well. What's up, Silhouette? I played a bunch of Skyrim. I haven't tried Oblivion. Do you like it so far? I love it, dude. It's so good. It honestly might be a little bit better than Skyrim. At least, like, combat-wise. I think the combat is definitely better. Um... It's too, it's too early for me to say if the exploration is better in Skyrim. I think the exploration in this game is great, but Skyrim had... You know, I haven't explored that much, to be honest, in Oblivion yet, so I, I can't say for sure just yet. Skyrim had Blackreach. That's all I'm thinking about. But, you know, maybe this place has something like that, too. I hope it does, but, you know, I'm not gonna get my hopes up. Oh, there's the cave. Okay, sandstone cavern. I'm scared to go in here. Where's my quest list? I'm afraid to meet the sunken one. Well, also kind of excited. I do like a good evil, <laughs> evil demon lord, but um, what if you kill me? I'm trying to make some potions real quick. That's a pretty good potion I just made. I want to make like a... That's fine. I want to make like a poison of some sort. Did I do the Crimson Nerd Root quest in Skyrim? I did. I did, actually. <laughs> I can't stop sniffing the fucking perfume. <laughs> I'm addicted. Um, I feel like they should have done a lot more with Blackreach unique mobs and stuff. Oh, that's actually something that's been pretty noticeable to me with Oblivion. I feel like the the mobs are unique, but they do change, I think. Someone was saying the other day, what the fuck is hurting me right now? Oh. Someone was saying the other day that they scale, like the mobs will change with your level, which is really interesting. So it changes like the variety, like, the, you know, they'll like change entirely, not just like a stronger version of themselves. This is a terrible sound right now. It's like a very sharp sound. I did not like that. Ooh, glow dust. What kind of perfume? Um, it's, it's called S pistachio gelato, but um, it smells like vanilla ice cream. Kind of. Skyrim made stronger variants, but not that different models. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking about. That the like the mod models are like entirely different. Like that alien thing, never saw that before. That was a fucking surprise. <laughs> it's crazy how good this game was back in the day, and people don't even realize that this game is amazing even now. I, I'm. This is my first time playing it. Like I have no nostalgia for it, and I love it. I'm having a great time. It holds up so well. Yeah, I can't imagine how hard this game hit, like, playing it, what, 18 fucking years ago? That's so hard to- Oh! <gasps> Shit. A bow of blizzards? I don't even use bows and arrows, but I'm taking it. That's cool. I'm finding a lot more enchanted weapons now, which is really awesome. I was really- Really lacking on enchanted things. A bear and a rat. Sorry to the bear.
Dude, those are hard to harvest. It's like hard to get my cursor to like aim at them and pick them because they're so tiny. Grand necklace of sea walking? Holy shit! Enchanted necklace! I don't think I had any necklace at all, and I have an enchanted one. Let's go. What perfume is it? It's called pistachio gelato. Pistachio gelato. Did I just go in a giant circle? There's no way. Oh, nope. What the fuck is that thing? An ogre? Or, yeah, an ogre. Oh man, my enchanted item's out of enchanted charge. That's not good. Dude, this ogre's gonna fuck me up. I bet ogres don't like fire. Okay, I don't have enough magic. <laughs> I'm scared. Right, he's actually not attacking me though. That's good. I don't know what the fuck's happening. That's too dark. I can't see. Oh my god, he is fucking me up! Oh my god. Okay, gotta burden him. to heal up. I will die. Please don't kill me! Please! Oh fuck, dude. Corner. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, I just used like all my potions <laughs> on that one fight. Holy fuck. Dude, never seen an ogre before. That's insane. Dude, he had a knife on him this whole time. He didn't even need to use it. Look how gigantic his feet are. Look how muscular. Look at his calves. They look like a pumpkin. Dude, you do not want to see an ogre on the streets. That's insane. Hi, Enyo. This is the one with the crazy potion making in game. Yeah, the potion making is pretty cool. You, I like that you can do it all in your inventory. You can get pretty crazy with it, I feel like. I think I can make a health potion, maybe. No. Maybe. No. Alright, let's keep it moving. Save the game, though. <sighs> Did we even- there was a Minotaur attacking me, too. I don't even know where he went. I ran for my life so scared, I don't- I think I went the wrong way. Ogre society considers it a mortal sin to skip leg day. <laughs> Generations of scholars have tried to figure out what this means. <laughs> we gotta keep studying them. We gotta dissect them. Maybe we'll figure it out.
There's a Zolcano event for the clan. Five minutes if anyone wants to join. Yeah, if anyone plays RuneScape and wants to do Zolcano with, with our RuneScape clan, Bills is hosting an event. I want to join the event, but I don't want to stop playing Oblivion. <laughs> Resist frost, 25%, okay. I'm finding all the good stuff today. And you can have two rings on at once. One for each hand. Let's fucking go. Is it bowling? Cannot repair items when enemies are nearby. There are no enemies nearby. Oh, I can fucking barely see her. And we should just pushed my guy off a cliff. All right, it's fucked up. Marley. Oh, should we playing Oblivion now? I missed the past three weeks. <laughs> the past three weeks were, were pretty filled to the brim with, with Skyrim. Yeah. We finished Skyrim. We're on Oblivion now, and it's awesome. I love this game. I love Skyrim as well, of course. I mean, also, if you guys haven't seen it, you should watch my you should watch my Skyrim video that I post on my main channel. I haven't uploaded on my main channel in a while. And... I'm really proud of that video. I think it's really, really well done. I'm opening this crate. Yes! I'm trying to be more patient with my lock picking because I don't want to waste all my lock picks. I got I've been lock pick less for a while now and it was really hard terrible life, so I'm trying to be really careful with them now. How do I get down there safely? I think I just have to drop down. <gasps> My luck is being drained. Give it back. Oh my fucking god, she healed up. Oh! Dude, honestly, she's got a great figure. Figure, that's a hard word to say. She fucking works out. Is there gonna be a part two of the video? Yeah, there will be. There's, there's probably gonna be a couple Skyrim videos just cause there's a lot I wanna highlight from my first playthrough. It's, it's not gonna be like a full, you know, like, it's not gonna show everything that happened, like full recap, but just like the, the best parts. <laughs> Would tap that route. <laughs> Honestly, can't blame you. I remember playing this in grade seven with no fucking clue what's going on, making the worst character possible. Dude, that's kind of me right now, making the worst build possible. I think I've... Spell absor absorption. I think my build, like I'm kind of figuring it out, maybe. I feel like it's going a little bit better. Maybe it's, maybe it's just that I got better armor though and it's carrying me. I don't know which way to go. Is this pre Elder Scrolls? This game? This is an Elder. This is Elder Scrolls. It's an Elder Scrolls Four. A sandstone big rooms. All right. What's up, chimp? Oh, I see a minotaur. He doesn't see me. To repair my armor finally. I'm working my way down to Elder Scrolls 1. I pretty much am. Like I said, I, I would love to try like the really old ones, but I can't like 
promise that they're going to be super playable. But I would definitely be open to trying them. Yes! Ebony Diamond Ring. What quest are we doing then? Um, right now I'm investigating and trying to save a guy. This this guy went to go offer himself to the sunken the sunken one. I've never heard of the sunken one before. But apparently he's an evil guy, and he takes uh I don't know. He takes offerings. I I'm assuming that means sacrifices. I think he's going to go sacrifice himself to save the world. Um, and I'm gonna save him. Mind go to sacrifices right away. Maybe he's just doing some cash offerings or a fruit basket. <laughs> That's true. He could be. My mind's definitely going to a, a dark place with it. Is this for the mage skill? No, I I stumbled upon like a random house, and it said to investigate. Like a quest popped up to investigate what happened. So I'm I'm investigating. We're checking it out. Dude, I like this spell absorption. Pants. Holy shit, look at those pants! Dude, that is clean. Let's keep looking. Keep looking around. Oh my fucking god, he's still alive. Whoa. I don't really know which way to go, because I saw there's a tunnel down here, too. I, I want to go in each direction. Hey, Vados, thanks for the, the one year! It's an Elder Ring was close enough. Hell yeah! Welcome back, Vados. I actually am going to stream Elden Ring um, in May. To I'm going to replay it before the DLC comes out. To be, like, lore ready. So I want to do, I want to do some lore investigating with the DLC. Oh! This cave is gigantic. Danger gauntlets. Well, I want to wear those, but they. I don't have an enchantment. Oh my god, there's so many directions to go. Oh, I don't like those glowy things. How are you supposed to kill just a glowing entity? <laughs> It's so hard to fight. I can barely fucking see it. And they fuck you up. Like, it's making me dumber. My intelligence is being damaged. I did it. I guess they don't like fire. playing Skyrim on, my, on the PS5 right now. Nice. How's it, how's it look on the PS5? Does it look good? Trying to get my laundry cooked in and get to meet everyone. Nice to meet you too, friend at arms. Hope you enjoy your dinner. Did I check this chest?
<laughs> I'm getting nervous because I don't want to break my lockpick. Ah! Ooh, it's leveled up in lockpicking. Very nice that this one didn't fall down, at least. Okay. Oh! Mace of Voltage, Shock Damage, and Soul Trap? I'm finding the coolest things in the whole game right now. Oh, but I'm carrying too much! 353 out of 340. Gotta put something away. I'm putting the bow away. I don't use bow and arrow. I'm putting away these cheap rings, too. Hmm. Hey, Shadow, thank you for the sub. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Man, this, is, this is hard. I'm getting so much good stuff. I, like, I actually don't have room for it. It's okay, it would be sick to see you just saying, hey, thank you for the bits, Banff. I know I, I do want to participate, but I, you know, I, I, I can't just stop in the middle of a, I can't stop this quest in the middle of it. I gotta see this shit through. I gotta find out who the sunken one is. I'm invested. And Barley, thank you for the 14 months. Ashamed to admit how quickly I started mass buying lockpicks and spam spamming auto unlocks. <laughs> I haven't even had the opportunity to buy like a ton of lockpicks. I'm not finding a ton. Oops. Hi, Jeff. Hi, Valentin. Uh, what's a gnome child from your stream bio? Um, it's a, it's a character in RuneScape. It's a wacky looking gnome in RuneScape. Where's Bill's at today? He's hosting a, a clan event on RuneScape. Bringing everyone together. Okay, I don't even know which direction I came from at this point. I'm lost. Like, was I just here? I have no idea. Nope, I wasn't, because that ogre was not known to me. on. Child's considered to be a relatively old meme now, even for RuneScape. Oh yeah, definitely. Oh, oh my god, it's almost accidentally closed the whole game. Oops. I want to see if I can make a potion out of the ogre teeth that I just got. If I could find them. I do. Shock damage. Damage intelligence. Damage, intelligence, and willpower? That's sick! They fucking them up? Mm, I don't wanna do that. 
Damage intelligence again. Take it. Oh, I leveled up, but I, there's no bed for me to sleep in. I wonder where ogres sleep. Oh, glass armor. It's, like, it's too heavy. I can't even take it with me. Fuck. This cave is insane. I'm finding the coolest shit I've ever found in my life. To make sure I come back here, pick up the loot one day. Equip it for fashion, please. Glass is beautiful. But I I can't. I can't even hold it. I don't have room to pick it up. This is just a dead end. Did I loot this? <gasps> Grand soul gem. Is this a runescape? Honestly, this, this, this game is RuneScape-esque. First-person RuneScape with the, you know, with the different skills to level up. <laughs> we got we got agility somewhere. I just saw it. Athletics, like in RuneScape, defense. Um, herb lore. I got got range. Yeah, I call it RuneScape 4. <laughs> this old game is is nice and upgraded RuneScape. A torch. Okay, I think we go down here. I think we drop down. I'm ready for it. It's like RuneScape has stats. Exactly. Very RuneScape-esque in that way. Wait, this is where I just was. Okay. Do they have my favorite skill, fire making? Oh no, that's the guy who I came to save. No, I don't think they have fire making. <laughs> Should search around him to learn the conclusion to a sad journey. Look his last journal entry. It seems he fell here believing he was truly going to meet his god and give an offering to him to help all of Tamriel. His death is a sad end to such a well-intended sojourn. This is the offering. Let's read the journal. I hear battle music, but I gotta read the journal. You gotta know what happened. I am fallen. I have failed. I will not reach him in time. And because of me, man is doomed. The creature jumped me without warning, and before I could dispatch it with my magic, it dealt me a mortal blow. Now all of Tamriel will face wanton destruction and death. His wrath will be unspeakable, his anger immense. Kavach was just a small amount of his true potential. All hope is lost, the sunken one wakens, and soon man will feel his hunger. What's that a fucking terrible note to read? Ah! Oh my god! <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that like actually scared <laughs> Dude, I don't know why that scared me so bad. I heard the battle music and everything and it jump scared the fuck out of me. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Alright. <laughs> Also, this thing is fucking me up. It's doing really big damage on me. Let's see if I can. Let's see if I can silence him with po poison. Silence effect resisted. That shouldn't be a thing. Hey, Pam. Thank you for the hundred bits. Oh my god. Guess what artist you're listening to? It's one of my favorites. Uh, MF Doom. I don't know, it's a, it's a hard guess. You gotta tell me the genre, at least. Um, I need- I think I have a, a... Resist shock for only 15 seconds? That's not a lot of time, but I'll- I'll take it. Oh! <gasps> oh my god. 
god. <laughs> I might die here. I've got like no healing potions left. Oh, Holy oh. fuck! Oh. oh my god, I gotta use my ult. I'm ulting. Did he just heal up? Did he just- No, he didn't. Maybe he did. Dude, this is so fucked up! He's almost dead, but I'm almost dead. Health potion. Bam, thank you for the 100 bits again. As long as magazine fat gives you a hint. Oh, suicide boys. I haven't listened to him in a long time. The eyes. You like them. I'm hoping my, I'm hoping my summon kills him. While I just oh. try and tank. I can't even fucking tank. Oh no. <gasps> oh my god, we got it! Holy fuck, good work, Kyle. I think that's what we said we were naming him, Kyle. <laughs> God damn, he's such a beast. Dude, R.I.P. to Slythe. It's a sad, sad end to his journey, for real. Maybe I can make the offering. Is this the end of the cave? Maybe we could still save everyone. I think that's the end of the cave. Yeah, because it doesn't go deeper than that. At least we avenged his death. There's no way that guy was the sunken one. This, I mean, this guy was strong. Wait. But it does say he was the sunken one. What? I mean, this guy was strong, but he wasn't like a fucking god or anything. Huh. All right, well, I guess he was. I guess we solved the mystery. <laughs> He made you ult pretty tough. That's true. It, I, yeah, I did use like all my potions that would be helpful. It was a tough fight for sure, but you know, I don't really think he was the one that destroyed Kavach or anything like that. I think those were two unrelated uh, events. Oh my fucking God, mountain lion in here. <laughs> My armor's probably so broken right now. Oh, fuck. And a fucking bear? What is happening? Oh, my God. What the hell? Where is everyone coming from right now? I'm out of here. I don't know where the exit is. <laughs> I'm gonna die. Oh, fuck. I don't think I have anything to help. I think I'm fucked. Shield. Bam, thank you for the 100 bits again. Um, how you like in Vegas? Um... It's fine. <laughs> like, it's definitely not the... Okay, I don't want to do that one. Yeah, I'm, I think I'm dead. I think this is fine. It's not like I'm gonna die. 
It's not my favorite place to live for sure, but I'm definitely getting used to it. I guess before we progress this time, let me see if I can make a potion that's gonna help in any capacity. It's something to restore magic. That's good. How long ago did I move here? Um, I think two. Two years? I think it's. I think I've been here for two years. I will say I did not like Vegas when I first moved here, but the longer that I stay here, like the more good things I'm finding about living here, if that makes sense. Yeah, these things are not helping me. Surely you got some restore health. I don't. I have no health potions. <laughs> and I don't have my ult. <laughs> oh, but I should repair my armor. I think that's why I was getting fucked up. That definitely helps. Also, I'll use a different weapon for a little bit. Okay, these are broken. I can't repair those. So I guess I go back to my, my ebony ones. Is that a stronger power? No, I used it. I used my ult. We just go, we go carefully. I heard the food in Vegas is great though. Huh? Um, yeah, the food's been pretty good so far. I don't have a lot of like places to compare it to. That's been pretty good. I don't know. Vegas is pretty cool. There are good things about it. It's just like definitely wouldn't be my number one choice for like where I would want to live. But I do like it. I've actually been really happy that normally I don't like the summer. Oh shit. Oh. Normally I don't like the summer, but I, it's been getting warmer. I've actually been really hyped that it's getting warmer. I'm ready for summer this year. Oh my fucking god. Where's the door? Oh god. I really hope bears can't use doors. Don't know if they know how. I don't think bears can use doors. Okay, it's good. Hey, Tex, thank you for the 47 months. Hello, hello. Kids out, too much hype and fake positivity. Summer's fake? Um, I I'm not sure I know what you mean about the fake positivity just because of summer. <laughs> Hey, what's up, Mitsuki? <laughs> if bears could use doors, humans wouldn't be the apex predator anymore. <laughs> Honestly, probably true. Any filled soul gems? Um. Oh, this one, this one is going to recharge my sword. I don't have a lot of empty ones, though, but good to use it. Oh, fuck. I thought this was the summoned bear. Nice. He's gone his ass. They have a lot of celebrity chef restaurants in Vegas. Yeah, they probably do. I don't I don't know much about like the actual like fancy restaurants. Like probably all the fancy ones are on the strip. And I don't go to the strip. Like that's a it's a very isolated part of Vegas. Hey Mitsuki, thank you for the sub to Cletus. Appreciate it, Mitsuki, thank you. I went to Gordon Ramsay's restaurant in Vegas. How was it? Was it worth it?
and skip song. <laughs> Not sure I, I could actually skip this one. <laughs> this is uh this is the video game built in music. I guess right now there is no music. Oh, I didn't open this? Damn, we're skipping all the songs today. Hope you guys like silence. Cause that is what you're getting regardless. Okay. I think I've looted everything in this cave, maybe? I don't actually know. Oh yeah, here's the exit. Holy shit, there's a portal over there. Oh, he saved Kavach again from the, the sunken one, even though I really don't think he was the one destroying the city. I think it's a very unrelated thing. Oh, he saved it again? Let's level up. Endurance. I'm oh, I'm I'm putting a lot of points on strength because I really want to be able to carry more. I'll do intelligence. My conjuration spells are stronger. Gotta go. Have a great night. Good night, Bam. Thank you for the bits again. I hope we have a good night too. Thanks for hanging out. Torch away somehow. Oh, I was actually we were going north to get to the city of Coral, Choral, Coral. But I'm gonna circle back to up here real quick. See if I can sell stuff to the the little camp. You've earned every ounce of your success. That's a very very kind thing to say, Niccolo. <laughs> Thank you. She just killed the sunken one, but she keeps trash talking him while he's dead. Salt on the wound. <laughs> I'm just saying, I think the guy that went and sacrificed himself to him had the had the really wrong idea about who's destroying the cities in this game. Well, the one city. Yes, I'm 24 pack beer. How's the gameplay? It's going good today. I just got some crazy armor and weapon upgrades. Feeling good, feeling powerful. How are you doing? Also, someone, sorry, I, I forgot to reply. I'm replying late. Just someone asking what conjuration spell I'm using. Um, it's summon Dramora. It's a really, I think it's a very strong conjuration spell. My conjuration level is also pretty high. I think it's actually my highest level. So that could be part of why it's so strong too. I don't know, I think it's actually just a strong summon. I too am feeling powerful today. Good, that's a good feeling to feel. What's your conjuration level at? Um... Ninety-one! Holy shit, I didn't know it was that high. Ninety-one. Almost maxed it out. Almost ninety-nine. Oh! I don't know what level the skills go to. Nine, let this happen. Are they angry? I'm just lucky. You closed. What can I interest you in? Hmm. Oh, not. I'm just gonna sell my got... random junk to her Let's because see. I. I'm You've not selling it. my good armor to her. She gives garbage prices. You. Good deal. 
Thank you. For the right pride. Just gonna fix my stuff also. Very unfair prices. You too. I'm just Thanks. Kavachi. I have potions and everything you need to make your own. <sighs> potions are not very good. Wait, potion of healing. That's good. You just buying potions from her. You That's Thank All right. Farewell. Pink hair floats in her e-girl phase in game. Yep. I actually love pink hair. I had pink hair in real life for a little bit like 4 years ago. So basically a million years ago. It's actually almost no, it's like 5 years ago now. Um and I love pink hair. In fact, she didn't have anything to make her own potion, said the narrator. Oh, I've got ingredients, just not the right ones. I can't make a health potion right now. I don't have the right stuff for it. Okay, really quick. I'll be right back. I gotta pee. I just guys, can't sleep. You guys mingle with the townsfolk. I'll be right back. Eyes, but I can't stop thinking about it. It's the smell, really. Smoke and fire and something worse in the ruins. Gods. I don't even notice anymore. I guess you can get used to anything. I just can't sleep. I lie down and close my eyes, but I can't stop thinking about it. I've looked everywhere. Perhaps she's still in Kavach, in the basement, hiding? I'm just tired. I can't face it. I have to start over from nothing. Don't give up. You're not alone. And the chapels it's and the, the elder smell, council really. will help us. Smoke and it just fire takes and time. something worse in the ruins. I've looked everywhere. Perhaps she's still in Kavach, in a basement, hiding? How could the Nine let this happen? Are they angry with us? The NPC interactions right in this game. <laughs> Are they angry with us? I do really love listening to them interact with each other. I'm just lucky to be alive. Alright. I wanna stay. That anger keeps me going. Um sorry, scrolling up in the chat. What's up, Resonant? I heard about the Summer Set Isles. I know that's the name of a DLC that I have. But, um... I haven't, like... I don't think I've started it. I was going through the VODs initiation to the Thieves Guild. It was 10 out of 10 hilarity. <laughs> yeah, I definitely am not the thief that they were... I'm not the type of thief that they were hoping to attract to the Thieves Guild, I think. I think they wanted someone more sneaky, but, you know, they got what they got. Recruiting is tough in Tamriel. Yeah, there's not, not a lot of good options <laughs> for who to recruit. They gotta, they gotta make do with me 
I'm, I'm learning though. I'm getting better at stealing a little bit. I'm learning how to lockpick way fucking better than before. I'm not, I'm still not that good at being stealthy, but we're working on it. I know now to take off my heavy armor when I'm trying to be stealthy for real. So that's something. All these flowers. Who are we fighting? Oh my fucking god, bear. These bears are actually like insanely strong. Oops. Oh my, what am I doing? I'm wasting all my mana and pressing the wrong thing. Fuck, I might die. <laughs> I don't want to use my health potions, I just got these. I only have two of them anyway. I'm so fucked. die because I can't fucking move. Just let me run away, please. Just let me run. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. Holy shit, a, a random ass hero! A fucking hero on the road! Oh, I'm stuck on a rock. Oh my god. Oh! Okay, he's not a hero. He's an enemy. <laughs> he was a hero for a moment. I think we'd make a really good team together if we didn't kill each other right now. I think we'd be really good together. He had so much potential, he really did. Die. <laughs> Am I supposed to be impressed? Now oh, there's two of them. Here. Die, Kerr. Oh. Oh. oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Oh shit, I want that. I can't move. <laughs> huh. Just ever so slightly over encumbered. Let's eat some fucking berries or something. I don't know. Nope, still over encumbered. Let's eat some of these things. You know, wearing a helmet. Um, I just don't have one right now. The my ebony armor set did not come with a helmet. Oh, that's a nice face. Too heavy though. I really am carrying carrying around too much stuff. I need to depart ways with something, but I don't know what. I just want everything. Well, a lot of the stuff actually that I have, I want to sell, but I want to sell for a good price. And the nearest shopkeeper gives me bad prices. It's really inconsiderate that the person you looted that armor off of didn't have a helmet. I know! It was fucked up! Didn't they know that I would- I could really use one? 
how far are you into the different guilds and such? Um, not very far at all. I think the only guilds I joined were Mage Guild and Thieves Guild. And Thieves Guild, I've, I haven't really done anything yet. Um, Mage Guild we're doing today. I'm actually, I'm journeying towards Coral right now so I could do my Mage Guild quest over there. Speak. My initiation. Nothing for Fighter's Guild. No. I'm not really interested in the Fighter's Guild right now. I might be interested in it later. But right now I'm, you know, I'm more of a mage right now than a fighter, I'd say. Even though I use melee more than I use magic. Um, but is that true? I don't know if actually that's true because I, I use Conjuration a lot. something here. <gasps> Beautiful statue! I'm doing a lot of exploration today. I've been sticking to the paths a lot and I'm, I'm venturing out today. Oh! This place has an entrance. I'd love to explore it, but I'm car- I can't explore anything because my inventory is too full right now. Shit, a goblin. even loot anything right now. Oops. Can drop stuff in a chest, come back later. I don't even have a chest to drop stuff into. Whoa! Okay, we're not far from a city. We're not far from Skingrad. I could sell stuff there for a very nice price. I think we're actually really close to Skingrad, if I recall correctly. I think I can see it in the distance. Where's the pack mule follower? I do need one of those. I need Hilda back. <laughs> I love that the Dramora talk shit when they fight summon, summon your own personal shit talker. Yeah, that's good for me, because I don't talk a lot of shit. I think at least. Maybe I do. Oh! <gasps> she just summoned a ghost? That's not fair. Only I summon stuff usually. I'm over encumbered. I can't fucking move. Okay, I'll use magic here. It's a magic moment for me. Wait, what? I thought she was dead. Okay, now she's dead. <laughs> I'm no longer over encumbered. Hey, angry dolphins, thank you for the eight months. When she ragged all like that, her soul jumped at her body or something. Or yeah, or, or her spine got fucked up. Alright, we're very close to the town. Here's some marmalade. How's it going? A glowing weapon for a second, but then he changed to a different weapon. Oh. Oh. I really gotta 
I level up my magic. Okay, he just healed up. Cool glowing weapon. Bandits make good money here. Yeah, they're they're fucking rich. Richer than I've ever been, except for right now. I'm unbelievably wealthy right now. Well, especially once I sell my stuff. Once I sell my stuff, I'll be, be disgustingly wealthy. What the fuck? Where'd you come from? The fuck where'd you come from also? What? A hedge wizard. That's the best you can do. I've never seen one of these before. They're fucking fast. Oh, whoa. How's she not dead? There we go. Ah, oh, fuck. <laughs> that was, uh, I just tipped it over. Can't carry more. Okay, that didn't even help. Alright, that potion didn't help either. There we go. Loving your raw channel. Thanks, Cletus! Yeah, if anyone wants to be the coolest, most helpful person in the world, it would be pretty cool if you subscribed to my VOD channel. I'm trying to get a thousand subscribers on it, because that's how much you need to monetize it. I thought it was 500, but I was wrong. Been, been begging everyone I know, asking all my friends, all four of them. I thought there was a 500 tier. So it turns out 500 is enough to like that's how you can have like membership on youtube which is like subscriptions but like i don't stream on youtube i'm not gonna enable that that would be silly uh but to have ads you need a thousand so fucked up <laughs> all right creating 400 more accounts <laughs> well, you know i wouldn't i wouldn't mind <laughs> let's come back shivering isles one the dlc um, I don't know. I'd pr I'd probably wait to do the DLC to like later on, in the oh the, the stores are closed, like later in my playthrough. I feel like it's still too early. I haven't even seen everything that's in the in the main game yet. Oh, it's very. What's with the lighting here right now? What the heck? Everything's so green. Got me fucked up. Sleep in this bed. Nine hours. Alright, everything's Hello, normal again. Today. Oh, Go sell ahead. me potions. I mean, not potions, Could spells. I interest you in some of my wares? Hmm. Hmm, I don't have enough magic for these spells. What's my destruction skill? We gotta take a look at that. 56. What do you want? A little low. Can I interest you in some of my wares? All of these need 75. I gotta get grinding. You too. Hello there. Well met. These lady spells are impossible to cast. I remember having an endgame character still being unable to cast them. That's fucking wild. 
Yeah, they need a lot of magic. I just have to like put points on my magic level, I think. Not so loud, please. Sorry. Armor, weapons, I have it all. How okay, selling these to detect life. This 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 is light armor, and I don't really use light armor too much, but I'm gonna keep these because I I like that spell absorption. I think that sounds pretty useful. I mean, these Daedric Gauntlets look really cool, too, but I think mine are better. Wait, no. Wait, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mine are better, but they just need to be repaired. So I'm gonna sell you those. You drive a hard bargain. Yeah, all this stuff I will keep. Thank I can fit. Either repair my stuff. Let's do business. I repair hammers. I... Nice. Bye. Do I have an enchanted item on that produces light? Oh, I... <laughs> I drank a potion that was called light. I thought it meant light, like, lightweight, but I guess the potion produced light. I fully misunderstood that, the potion. Here, all this. Man, I love this town. Skingrad, it's a cozy ass place. Yes? May I interest you in some of my fine. Okay, I want to upgrade my potion making stuff. So I have expert, expert, okay, apprentice alembic. Expert alembic. Yes. A bargain at any price. Sell so that one. And this is Journeyman. Expert Calcinator, let's go. Sell so that one. Fine transaction. Expert, 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 expert. So Kano Fund, I've never done it. Um I haven't done it too many times, but it was it was fun for a bit when I did it. You Definitely not something I'd like song. to do every day. Oh, strong health potion. Expensive. You think you'll end up trying Morrowind? Oh, absolutely. I plan on playing Morrowind pretty soon. Um, I wanted to play it after Oblivion, but the Elden Ring DLC comes out. It's pretty soon, so I think we'll finish Morrowind. Or, sorry, Oblivion. Finish Oblivion. Um, play Elden Ring and the Elden Ring DLC, and then play Morrowind. I'm really excited for Morrowind. A lot of people have said they think it's gonna be my favorite game. Because of, um, how I like taking notes on things. Which is true, I do really like taking notes on things. I like, um, I like a game that doesn't direct you too much. You've made it. That's a good deal. Goodbye. All right. Maybe we can make some better potions now. I definitely I recommend assist. having a notebook for Morrowind. Oh, I absolutely will. Do I actually write notes? Um, I write notes in like for from soft games like Dark Souls, Elden Ring. I kept in a lore notebook for everything, and I really enjoyed that. Oh, the the. The Nern Root guy said he was gonna make me a potion. I'm finally coming back for it. Said he was gonna make me a crazy potion. One like never made before. Any more luck or an elixir. Give me Here's my stuff. A elixir of exploration. Not bad, eh? If you want more, you can buy them from me. I've discounted them for you, of course. Nice. I got a new elixir. Let's see what it does. Like, I'll fortify health for 300 seconds and night eye. That's cool. Honestly, I thought it was gonna, <laughs> I don't I thought it was gonna do something different just based on the name. Elixir of exploration. I was thinking it would like, <laughs> I don't know. Like make secret places. Uh, visible. I don't know. My expectations were too high. Uh, 
Okay, now we're finally gonna go to Coral and get my get my Mage Guild quest. Finally going. What is still taking up so much weight? I guess I do have a lot of armor. Am I still doing no fast travel? No, I fast travel here and here and there, but I do really like moving throughout the like in-game world. I like exploring. If I'm feeling lazy, I'll you know I'll fast travel. Okay, we just gotta go straight north from here. Straight north. Like I could fast travel to Coral right now, but I wanna I wanna explore. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Great start. I jump- <laughs> I jump off the bridge, break both my legs. It's gonna be a good journey. Hey, what's up, Nim Nim? That's not painful. Ah, oh, just a- just a couple broken limbs, no big deal. Just a few. Exploring is the best part of Elder Scrolls. Yeah, exploring is fun. I have- I have so much of the map that I haven't even been to at all yet. And like a ton of ruins I want to explore. But I am going straight north right now to Coral, because we do need to quest there. I just need to get my Mage Guild quest, see what they need from me. What task I gotta do. Find some flowers on the way too. Oh, an oblivion portal. All this Bethesda talk is reminding me how sad I was with Starfield. Do you think Starfield is like a game they're gonna fix eventually? I didn't play it, I didn't like look into it at all, but I, I do know how disappointed people were. I saw all the tweets, people being mad. Bethesda, no modders, probably. Well, at least there's hope. Oh my god, my Dremora got jump scared me. Give me my magic power. There's no fixing it, just soul soulless. What do you mean by that? It's soulless. Like the, was the story not good? Like were the characters not fleshed out or something? <laughs> what if they made Oblivion in Starfield? That would fix it. <laughs> That'd be pretty hype. <laughs> I think I've been in this guy's house before. I know there's no one in here. There's no one in here. I want that tomato. The world is barren and bland. Only fetch quests with not- with no actual content behind it. Oh, so is it more so like the lore? Like the world lore isn't fleshed out enough? Like the coolest part of Elder Scrolls for me has been the world lore. Like, reading the books in-game, trying to see, you know, just the, the story behind, like, the world we're seeing and exploring now, if that makes sense. That's, that's my favorite part, is just the world building is really well done, I think. So is it just that the Starfield world building was bad? Oh my fucking god! Goblin Warlord. Wait, I want to use my destruction spells. I do need to level them. They're oh. doing like no damage. <laughs>
man. How's he not fucking dead? Separation, oh shit. Thoughts on the GTA San Andreas playthrough? I would actually love to play that game. Um, like the, the story. I played San Andreas as a kid, but I was really young. I didn't even, like, I didn't know what the fuck was happening. I, I don't even have a lot of memories from that game, to be honest. I remember riding around on a motorcycle in-game, and that's about it. I have very few memories from it. I was too young. I've died twice at Zolcano. I might be the worst RuneScape player. No, dude, it happens. It happens. It's easy. It's easy to fuck up there sometimes. San Andreas was the first game you could get fat? Wait, that's kind of hype. I don't know what had that. I really don't know much about San Andreas, to be, to be honest. Oh fuck, a portal. We're gonna go around the portal. Not, I'm feeling heroic today, but you know, heroic enough to like, save a guy from a cave and, and help out the mages guild. Not heroic enough to defeat a portal. Yeah, San Andreas would be pretty cool to play. I've never played through the whole story of like any Rockstar game. The, the only Grand Theft Auto where I, like, played through the story partially was GTA 4. And even then, like, most of my time spent on GTA 4 was just roaming around, hanging out, exploring. All I remember from San Andreas is there's a quest that requires you to be fat. I would actually really love to... <laughs> to see the context of that quest, like, see how that makes sense. GTA 4 over GTA 5. Yeah, I didn't play GTA 5 very much. I, I didn't play a lot of Rockstar games at all. I played, like, Vice City when I was a really little kid, but again, I didn't play the story. I drove around and looked at stuff. I was probably five years old. Same with San Andreas, just drove around, looked at stuff. Because my, my brother had the games and sometimes he'd leave them like leave them running and I would go and play. Um and then GTA 4 was like the first GTA that I actually was like old enough to somewhat understand what was going on and be able to play and follow the story a little bit. I probably still like missed a lot of the context. Like I, I was still pretty young. Um but I played through it a little bit. And then and then when GTA 5 came out, I just, just wasn't really interested in it. That's when I was really into it. <laughs> this all comes, every game I talk about, like, that I didn't play or get into as a kid, it all just circles back to Call of Duty, where I was too addic addicted to COD to play anything else. So when GTA 5 came out, I was too addicted to other stuff. Didn't, didn't care for it too much. We're back to Way Wayland Priory. This body is still here. That's so crazy. Didn't clear it out at all. Did you play RuneScape in elementary school? No, I started playing RuneScape way later. I started playing RuneScape like end of high school. I started with old school RuneScape. And then I got horribly addicted to it. Just checking out what's in this place. I know I I know I've been in here, but I don't know. I thought we'd come take a look before I Hey, there's still a person here. Welcome, Pilgrim. 
The blades. The Tell blades me about the blades. The blades are closely linked to the Order of Talus. We both serve Talus, of course, and many of our brothers are former blades. I myself was training as a blade when I received the call to serve Talus in a different way. It isn't widely known, but many brothers of the Order of Talus are also members of the Blades. Oh, that's cool to know. Chapter houses of the Order, like Wayne and Priory, provide safe houses for traveling Blades as well as our more public religious functions. Blades who are too old for the active service often join the Order as lay brothers. The Order of Talos. Huh? We are honored to have Grand Master Joffrey, or Brother <laughs> Joffrey as he prefers, as a resident here. I thought you were like 24. I'm 27. Goodbye. I'm in my 20s. I feel like I'm, I feel like I'm younger than 24. <laughs> Good afternoon. So is this a Church of Talos? Just any, tr any church. Let's go to the, to the town. Let's get my mage guild quest. Um, you're in like your first year when I started watching of university. I think, I think, yeah, that's around when I started streaming first year of university. That guy is involved. A haircut is a choice. <laughs> Holy fuck, there's a minotaur here? In this peaceful town? This whole fucking world is falling apart. These damn portals. Guys, <laughs> he's all up in my face. level my destruction spells, but they really... My magic regens so fucking slow. There we go. Ooh, one, one dollar. I thought you didn't go to university. I went to university. I just didn't finish my degree. Because streaming started to go pretty well, and I wasn't really interested in what I was going to school for anyway. Fuck! What the hell? Fall before me, Breton. This guy's got a crazy weapon. It's like enchanted with fire. <laughs> I want that weapon. Oh my god, I can't see anything. He's fucking flashbanging me. What do I go to school for? A business degree. I literally can't see. I just chose that major because I had no idea what I wanted to do with my life. I had no idea what I wanted to go to school for. Oh, fuck, I'm over encumbered from that. Oh. Hmm. I gotta, I gotta work my inventory out at the town. Where's the fucking entrance to the town? I'm getting my ass kicked out here. I just want to go inside. I would love to be let into this city. switch to that but also am running a business I mean it's up to you individually if it's like worth it to you I had no 
use for a business degree. At, I feel like at the time, I really like, I was just going for business as like a filler while I figured things out. I still don't know what I'd want to go to school for. Like if I went back, I, I don't want to finish my business degree. That's for sure. It was not, it is not for me. My business school was like filled with frat bros. Like everyone in my class was a frat bro. Like I they just wanted to be an impose, entrepreneur. It was so. Have a look around. You won't find. It was just very much like not my realm. Like I did not fit in at all. I did not like it. Not my vibe. A good, a good price for a good customer. That sounds cringe. Um, I wouldn't say it was cringe. It was just not like the, just not my crowd of people. Business school is just frat bro heaven. Everyone else is hell. <laughs> yeah, that's kind of what it felt like. Like I just felt like I didn't belong at all. And excellent bargain. Hmm. I'm selling ah. this potion. Thank you. You too. This is an inn. What do you want? Oh yeah. Good. Day. All right. Where's the mage skill? Hello. Gotta find the mage skill. Oh wait. Blacksmith. What gotta can repair I repair some stuff? If it's bro. Every time I'm at the blacksmith, I gotta repair my sword because I can't repair it myself. Have a look around. You won't find better prices than all Tamriel. An excellent bargain. <laughs> I'm like considering selling this mace, but I like that it has soul trap on it. But at the same time, like, I have the soul trap spell, so I don't really need a weapon with it. But it's just, it's kind of just nice to have two weapons just in case. A pleasure. I guess one of mine breaks and I can't repair it. I don't know. I can't part with it yet. <laughs> STEM and humanities will always have beef until the business students show up, then they have a common enemy. <laughs> it's funny. Lure the people out of the city and then rob them. Oh! I think I should do that to them. They're, they're nice, hardworking people. How do you do? Hello. Hello. I'm Castor Scribonia, the writer, author of Woman Gone Wild. <laughs> I need my Mage oh. Guild recommendation. Who's, who's in charge? A pleasure here? to make your acquaintance. I'm Athragard of the Mages Guild. Who's in charge here? Training and spell. You too. Hmm. Well met. Hmm. You're seeing you. Excuse me. My name is Angalmo. Can I help you? Be the fuck? You. None of these people are the one in charge. Unless. Do I already have a quest from this town? I don't think I do. There's a, there's a slight chance, I guess, I have the quest already from here, but I really don't think that I do. Um... Okay, Ruma recommendation. This is not Bruma, we're in, we're in Coral. I don't think I have it here. It's the fingers one, fingers of the mountain. 
Oh, Irana's asked me to bring her a book. I need to tell Tikius about this immediately. All right. Thank you. I didn't know that I didn't realize those were related. I remember that lady asking me for that book and telling me not to tell anyone. I guess I got a snitch. How do you do? Yeah, I find Tikius. To what do I owe this pleasure? Hello. Going in the basement. Hmm. Oh shit, who's this guy? It's my pleasure. Please continue. Um. I'd steer clear of her if I were you. She has it in for Tikius and wouldn't hesitate to take any of us down with him. Holy shit, they got a rivalry. My hair is so I cold can't. in my room right now. You interrupted him. <laughs> he was writing in his diary. <laughs> Andrew, he's fast as fuck at reading. Look at him skipping all those lines. <laughs> he was reading so fast. He's a fucking genius. I'll be right back. I gotta grab a sweater. I'm freezing. One sec. Okay, I'm back. <laughs> Me reading the lusty Argonian maid for the thousandth time. <laughs> Dude, that would explain why he's uh, why he's going so fast. <sighs> you have to reach up for the doorknob? What do you mean by that? How short do you think 411 is? <sighs> My sweater, thank hey, you. I've been wearing it a long time. I, saw I don't know why I'm so fucking cold right now. Ugly little animals. Nasty creatures. Oh, there he is, Tikius! Go ahead. Got a snitch on that. On that lady. What? Not only does it exist. But she knows where it is? Well, this is unacceptable. That book needs to be in the safe Trying to find some guild. secret book. I trust that as a member of the guild, you would do the right thing and acquire this text before Irana does. I can Are do we it. clear? Ignore her request. Go to this place she has described and return with the book. This is far <laughs> more important than any petty squabble. Do I have dinner? Oh, um, yeah, I have like you have a faster meal for later. To be rid of Irana as soon as possible. I'll get rid of her. Are right, we gonna go get rid of this lady? I thought you were three eleven. Nope, went to the doctor yesterday. They measured me four eleven. Let's fucking go. What's new with you? I think I, if I remember the books like in the mountain. Oh yeah. Cloud top. Up. Oh, we're going north. You're growing. <laughs> you grew a foot. <laughs> yep. I've been I've been taking vitamins, you know. Finally growing. Did they laugh when they took the measurement? If you've got the stones yeah, I don't know if like something's in the water in Vegas, but there's actually a lot of short people here. Like people around my height. This is not the right building that I meant to go into. A lot of people around my height. I when I was at the doctor, the what is it? Um, I think the the nurse was around my height too. Going north, run straight south. Well, I gotta sleep in a bed first. I forgot where I lived. I live in the Mages Guild. What is it? 
What's in the water is that there is barely any in the desert? That's true. <laughs> that would explain it. Why all the RuneScape streamers live in Vegas? Yep, apparently it's a place to be. I mean, it is a good place to live if you don't go outside. If you never leave your house, it's not so bad. Right, where's a bed for me in this place? Okay. What the fuck? How is this an owned bed? This is the mage's guild. Any mage can sleep here, I thought. Where am I supposed to sleep? Okay, no bed for me, I guess. I won't sleep tonight. I'll just fucking stand here like a creepy person. Let me at least stand in the bedroom. Stand for 10 hours. <laughs> hey, Anon, thank you for the two gifted subs. Welcome, Con, Sizzle, and Sown Sparrow. Thanks, Anon. Hey, what's up, Kings? Vegas is cheaper than Cali. Yeah. And it's like close enough that if there is like an event in California, I don't know where the door is right now. Like, you can drive or fly, and it won't be a long flight. I understand why people live here. Hello. Hello. Whoa, this place is popping today. What do you. May I interest you in some of my fine wares? Hmm. Oh, <gasps> Danger Spider. Fuck, I can't afford it. Maybe I can haggle a little bit. Yes! Ooh! I'm hey, new... New conjuration spell. Goodbye. I like dogs, but it's a bit excessive with those two folks. Ah. Did you just say you like dogs? <laughs> I, her... I've missed half their conversation. Greetings. What exactly do you require of me? No, the height command is not true. I'm not 311. One of, one of the mods added that to try and tarnish my legacy. Alright, let's go north. We're going. Going to the mountains. Um, sorry, I missed some messages. I'm scrolling up. Quine and Jimmy, who else lives in Vegas? Yeah, Will and Hannah live in Vegas. Um... I think it's... Mudkip? I think he also is from Vegas. As far as RuneScapers go, I, that, those are the only ones I know in Vegas. Satan lives in Vegas, you think so? I guess he probably would like to live somewhere where it's absurdly hot. No clan for our Daedroth summons. Oh, I already have the... Oh, no, not Daedroth. Dremora. I already have the Dremora summon. Mr. House lives in Vegas. He has a RuneScape botting channel. I don't think I've heard of that guy. Do you have any wild tourist stories? No, I mean, all the crazy stuff in Vegas is extremely isolated, only on the strip, which is like the, the street with all the casinos. Like none of that stuff like permeates outside of the strip because the strip is hard to leave. Like as a tourist, if you don't have a car, it's hard to get off of the strip. It's, it's very contained. It's hard to get anywhere else. And the rest of Vegas is very normal. Like, I mean, you're living in a desert, so you get extreme heat and all that, but it's just very, very normal suburban life. Mr. House is a Fallout New Vegas reference. Oh, <laughs> yeah, I didn't play that game. My strip hard to leave guards. <laughs> Dude, they should guard it. That'd be awesome. They guarded it. No tourists leaving. No going anywhere else. No, it's like, it's just, yeah, it's a very not walkable city. I hear battle music. Oh, 
am I battling? Maybe that's just the music. Hmm. How's Oblivion treating you? Oh my god. My summon dying scared me. <laughs> um, how's Oblivion treating you? I have a preference of this over Skyrim. Oblivion's great. Um, Skyrim is great too. I like the combat better in Oblivion for sure. The combat and the movement feels way more fluid in this game. More satisfying. Um, I think Skyrim had more, like, points of interest to, like, explore, like, more, you know, random things on the map, but this game has a lot of good ones, too. Hey, why does this guy have, <laughs> why does this guy have pubes? <laughs> do they, do the minotaurs always have that? I've just never noticed. <laughs> I'm very thrown off right now. <gasps> no, they don't always have that. I think it was the fucking lighting. That was really weird. <laughs> I guess they I guess they got something. I guess yeah, well, maybe they do. They actually do. Why are you looking? Cuz it was glowing. It was glowing. I couldn't not look at it. Or it was like being highlighted or something. <laughs> it was hard not to notice. Fucking crazy. It was a distraction spell and it worked. <laughs> it fucking worked. Um. Sorry, I'm scrolling up. See messages I missed about Vegas. Um, even parts of the strip are terrible for pe pedestrians. Yeah, it's just not a walkable city. Like, a lot of places in the US aren't. Honestly, even if Vegas was like a walkable city, you probably wouldn't want to walk too much around here anyway. In the summer, like, it gets it's too hot in the summer. Probably be a pretty miserable experience trying to walk. She's fucking Christ. so OP in every game. I mean, bears are insanely powerful creatures. You do not want to fuck with a bear in real life, probably. <sighs> Is Canada different as in walkable? It just depends where you live. <gasps> the book! Oh, is that easy to get the book? I found the book. I'm going to deliver it to either Arana or Tikius. Honestly, I thought we were going to have to go into like a cave system or something. I didn't think the book would just be there. Hmm. Well, before I give the book away, let's read it. Where is it? Oh, can't read it. What kind of fucking book is that? I can't read it. Worst book I've ever found. I can't even open it. Pages stuck together. Okay, um, I honestly don't know who to bring it to. I, 
it's either bring it to the guy in the mage. I mean, yeah, I should bring it to the guy in the mage's guild because I need my mage guild recommendation. I guess the choice is made for me. Can't bring it to Arana. I won't get my recommendation. I mean, do you really want to open it if it has sticky pages on every page? <laughs> uh, I don't know. I mean, I'd still like to read it, but I guess not. things. Oh. Sometimes you go cut down a tree and collect some bugs before you can read it. That was such a good Skyrim quest, to be honest. Oh, the Elder Scroll one? Yeah, I liked that quest. I liked, um, I liked the whole thing with the moths. I think the moth priests in general are super fascinating. I I hope I learn more about them in this game. Or the older games. Either way, just hope I learn more about them. Hey, what's up, Siamese Sneeze? Howdy. My game just crashed. <laughs> it's okay. I think I, I've been saving like every five minutes, so. That's all good. But still, unfortunate. I feel like the times my game has have crashed have been like pretty convenient, to be honest. Like it... I don't think my game has crashed during any, like, super inconvenient or, like, intense part. Like, I haven't crashed during any, like, cutscenes. I haven't crashed during any, like, important fights. So, you know, even though it crashes sometimes, it's pretty considerate. It usually crashes when nothing's going on whatsoever. someone real quick old games don't like running well on your systems yeah i also there's a there's a patch for it that i just didn't uh install yet what's up j balls dude when i deliver this book to the guy in the mages guild he better let me read it or he better read it to me at least I want to know what the fuck is in this book, if it's that important. That's why I don't play Fallout awesome. 3 or New Vegas, because I can't. Raffletoes, he can't, like... There's definitely things he could download to help, like patches or something. There's no way they're just unplayable forever on, on PC. I got the book! Uh you found the oh, book. I did it. My trust in you was well placed, it seems. Hand it over, if you please. All right. Ah, yes. This is indeed the correct book. You've not been able to open it, I presume. No, and I tried. <laughs> then all is well. Open it you for me. You have shown me. yourself worthy of the guild, and for that I thank you. You shall have the recommendation you need. All right, but I want to know now, about the book. I must ensure this book is kept safe. Excuse me. Good to see you. Where the heck is he going? Are you going to play Fallout New Vegas next? I am going to play Fallout New Vegas, like, at some point in the near future, but no, not next. I got to play Elden Ring, then we got to play Morrowind. Where's what? the book? I have the book stored safely for now. I shall hold on to it until the council decides what should be done with it. Okay, that's fair. That's fair. Take care. Oh, where is it? I saw him put it in this room. There it is! I could just take it back if I wanted to. I'm not going to, though. 
I don't want to, you know, I don't want to fuck up relations with the Mage Guild. I'm gonna remember that that book is there, though. I might, I might go take it at some point. If I'm, if I'm interested in it. I don't know really much about that book. I'm gonna go talk to that Irana girl. Let's see if she tells me anything. What? And Snowball, thank you for the two months. How goes it? Great. I'd like to learn more about spell casting. Thank you, thank you. What's up, Kyle? Did I read the book? No, it didn't let me. It doesn't. It's kind of magic book. It didn't. It wouldn't open. It wouldn't let me read it. I think this is where. Hello. 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 Hard to complain Hello. about living in the world. <laughs> We've got everything you need. I don't know where that Urana lady is. I might say. Never mind. She said it was she's at one of the inns. I just don't know which one. I think I'll avoid that. Eli, I don't think it's this one. By the gods. Without Wait, this is a door. Heard any news from the other provinces? No. Nothing I'd like to talk about. What is it? It's not her. I don't even remember what she looks like. Please try the missing daughter dialogue. Um, at some point. At some point we'll come back. If we're, you know, if I'm feeling kind, feeling like helping someone with their missing daughter. Right now, I'm one track minded. We gotta find Arana. Good to see you. Well met. I'm hmm. thinking of doing some traveling. Why are my eyes so red? In real life, are they? I don't think they are. I do have allergies today. Could be that. Or I'm doing a lot of drugs. They look a bit red. I should probably take my allergy medicine then. I don't know why I've been putting it off. I just don't like taking it. It makes me sleepy. But now I'm insecure about it. She's crying because she couldn't read the book. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that, that actually was a. Uh, that allergy thing was a front. I was just really devastated I couldn't read the book in game. I was so excited to get it and read it. Now I don't know where this Arana lady lives or hangs out. So I could tell her that I gave her book away. Pity on an old raw veteran. Not her. The non drowsy stuff. I do have the non drowsy allergy meds, but they, I feel like they still make me not like extremely sleepy or anything like that, but definitely, you know, I feel like a little bit of a drowsiness from it, a teeny tiny bit. So desperate to self snitch. Well, I'm kind of. I'm thinking like maybe if I tell her that I gave the book away, she's gonna. She'll tell me more about the book. Damn, this is a nice house. Like, maybe she'll be like, what, you fool? A book summons a demon or something. I don't know. It's a fucking fancy house. She might have despawned since you completed the quest for the Mages Guild. She just disappeared. <laughs> just ceased to exist. <laughs> That's pretty insane. That's pretty hardcore. Just for not doing her quest. But yeah, I actually can't find her anywhere. Is this her? Oh my gosh, she was there the whole time. Waiting. Where is my book? I gave it to someone what? else. You gave him the book? What were you thinking? And here I thought one of you guild mages might actually have a brain. All right, all right, we can deal with this. You'll have to get it back, that's all. <laughs> Second You're in chance, the field, aren't you? You should be able to walk right in, find it, and take it. And if you can't, then break in. I want that book. Bring it to me once you have it. I need it. I need I to know why to she reward, wants it so promise, bad. Despite your the reward is not enough for go. me. I want to understand, like, why. Oh. 
I'll say yes, of course but... She will. Do whatever you must. I require that book as soon as possible. She's being kind of fucking I'm pushy listening. right now. What's new with you? <laughs> the guard was there the whole time when she's telling me to break in. Hey, go break the fucking law for me, <laughs> she says. Any progress yet? You should be. You don't want to fail me again. The fuck? Why is she threatening me? I believe I've made myself more than clear. She. she I want to help her. Book. She's being not a very nice expect person. You to clean up this little mess you've made. You're kind of a bitch to me. The, the mess that I made. Goodbye. I didn't even. She lost the book in the first place. <laughs> me personally, I'd kill her for speaking to me like that. <laughs> Oh, if it wasn't illegal. Any progress yet? You should be. You don't want to fail me again. Be seeing you. I don't fucking like her. I'm not getting her that book. I was I was thinking about it at first, but nope. She seems like a fucked up lady. Although I am kind of interested to see what happens, like you know, for the plot. I am a registered thief, like, I could totally get the book, but why would I want to if she's being so crazy? I do want to know what happens. <laughs> At the same time, I do want to see what happens. I think I'm going to steal the book, but not not for her, it's for me. Like, I'm going to give it to her, but not because I like her. I like really one. dislike her, but I want to know what happens. Am I really going to betray my, my fellow mages? I go with naked, it's the only way. Hi there. Have you heard Renoir got some new? You steal for the love of the craft, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> Imagine alarms just go off in the whole building. Nothing Welcome. suspicious here at all. I'm being very normal right now. Being very normal right now. Well met. The fighters deal they didn't even lock the chest. I feel like maybe they wanted me to seal it. Stones for it. How goes it? Ah. I'm gonna give her Farewell. the book, but Good evening. not what because I condone her speaking to me the way she did. I very much don't yours. condone it. Back again, are you? Do you have the book this time? She's making me not want to give it to her, but I want to know what happens. Why is she so fucking mean? Here's the book, oh, I guess, you wonderful. fucking mean lady. I'll just take this from you and get to work translating it. I'll need some time with this. Come and find me tomorrow. I'll be here until I've finished my work. But please don't disturb me until Wait, so I'm she's done. Gonna... This is quite a I might get to read the book if she's going to translate it. I might be well, able to, to read it. I yeah, mean, she's sweet now. She's suddenly really nice. <laughs> Out of nowhere. Crazy how and she switches up like that. Alright, she said she needs same. some time. Bye. And to not care. disturb her, I guess. Let's sleep. Let's see if anyone here noticed. Did you notice? Yeah. Curious that you should inquire about it, as it has recently gone missing. <laughs> you wouldn't happen to know anything about that, would <laughs> no, you? No, that's crazy of him to say. Nope. Do you would not know you? anything at all about that at all. What's up with this book? I don't know, should but I need gotta I read it. Be so let's wait a full 24 hours. Surely that's enough time for her to translate it. Wish I could sleep in a bed, but they don't have any beds for me in this fucked up place. In this fucked up world. You smell of death. From where do you hail? To be fair, if you asked someone to do something, they didn't do it, and they did it for someone you don't like, you wouldn't be nice either. True. That's true. Hello, my little friend. <laughs> She's I very nice suddenly. <laughs> my I've little friend. Most of the book to memory, 
but I took the time to write down a passage you might find useful. Okay. It contains instructions for acquiring a very special power. You'll want to read it carefully and then return to Cloud Top. I might have made the I right choice getting it for her. I this to be more than a worthy reward for your help. I believe you'll agree, assuming you're careful. She was just having a bad day. <laughs> Farewell. Let me read this little, little note. Um... I scroll. Oh, Arana's notes. My dear helper, most of the text you've given me is well beyond your comprehension. Okay. <laughs> um, I found one section, however, that appeared by the keepers of the Imperial... Or, sorry, I can't read. Had been appended by the keepers of the Imperial Watch. Their notes will be of use to you. Return to the ruins of Cloudtop. There you should find a section of pillars that looks remarkably unlike any other stonework present. Uh, the carvings on this pillar were made by the Aelids, and the pillar has been infused with significant power. The following was scribbled on the margins of the book, presumably by the same men who took the pillar from its original resting place. The, no the notes are smeared in places, so I have included what I could decipher. Do note that this sounds rather dangerous, and take whatever precautions you feel are necessary. Uh, only seems to function outdoors, where it reacts strongly to magic. Terrible power, capable of striking a man dead on the spot transported the stone to a secure location in order to study it more fully guild wizards brought in to focus power of stone several severely injured stone finely tuned to react to shock magic Vulcan stone necessary to harness stone's power success means power of shock unattainable through other means from these notes and the original alien inscriptions it seems that our imperial friends were attempting to harness some degree of the alien's magical power and were marginally successful I would suggest you procure a Welkin stone for yourself and return to Cloudtop to cast a shock spell at the pillar. What happens then, I think you can comprehend on your own. Alright, I think I have one of those stones. I do! And aliens carve the pillars. Go ahead, I'm listening. I think the Aelids are like an old race of elves. Old, ancient elf. Elven people. Okay, really quick before we go up there, I gotta go get a snack in real life and also take my allergy medicine. Here, I'll be I'll be the receptionist while while I get my medicine. I'll be right back.
come back. Sorry to find my Zyrtec. Oh. Is the painting in the room just like Elden Ring? I actually think this painting looks like the inside of the church in Anne Rolando. Right? I, I don't know if it's a church. In the building in Dark Souls 1. Like the building where the painted room... Uh, or not painted room, painted world is in. I think it looks like the reverse of that. In joining the Mages Guild. Is that a Minocqua, Wisconsin shirt? It is! I've actually never been to Wisconsin, but... Got a sweater. Alright, so I need a Welkin stone, and it says I need... I think they, she said, the note said to cast a shock spell, which... I think I have a shock spell, but I'm not sure. Shock and touch, I have that. How are you feeling about Oblivion so far? I like it a lot. I like it a lot. <laughs> You're wearing a Wisconsin shirt named Five Wisconsin Songs. <laughs> uh, Wisconsin State Anthem. Is that a thing? That's not a thing, it should be a thing. I think states should have national anthems. Well, not national, I guess, local. So I guess all stuff in the town. Um, I don't really know what I would sell right now. <clears throat> Hi, Rick. You play Dark Souls? Yup, Dark Souls 1. My favorite games. I think it is my favorite single-player game. The real challenge would be pronouncing the names of a lot of the cities. <laughs> yeah, well, I like those two. I would not even know where to begin. I struggle enough to pronounce commonly known regular words I'm trying to pronounce the name of like a, a town is too much for me have you ever played a game called old school runescape it's like oblivion but worse <laughs> honestly kind of got a point Did i find all the bosses in dark souls one um i mean to this day i don't know i did like a blind playthrough and I never, like, looked up any guides for it or anything. Man, my eyes really do hurt. I'm very big on- Oh, my game just crashed! No! I don't think I saved my game. That's okay, I didn't do anything, but I don't think I saved for, like, a couple minutes. <laughs> that was a very random crash. I don't know why my eyes are so irritated right now. I feel like since it got pointed out that my eyes are red, I've, I'm like feeling the irritation more. What if you missed a boss? Well, I plan on playing the game like multiple times. I like to revisit games I like, so that'd be a nice little treat for me. Hey, Lacey Logan, thank you for the five months. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I quit again. What's up, Wanny? Uh, quit what? Talking about RuneScape? Oh, maybe I did save my game. Alright. We didn't, we didn't lose any progress. Good, good, good. She rage quit. I <laughs> rage quit RuneScape. No, I, I still play. I still play here and there. Just not, um... Not as much as I used to. Most of the bosses are easy to find, but I actually did find one more in Dark Souls 1. After multiple playthroughs, I was pogging my pants. Yeah, that's like one of the best feelings ever. That's why I like blind playthroughs, and even after like my first playthrough, I still don't look things up. In case I want to play again. So that, that is the best feeling, like playing a game that, uh, you know, you, you know and love. And you think you've explored everything, and then you find out that there's more surprises. 
best fucking feeling in the world. Are you liking Oblivion more or less than Skyrim so far? Hi, Squiggles. I think, like, just ever so slightly more. I like the combat here more and, like, the movement and everything. Alright, so we're looking for a pillar that looks not like the others. So, I mean, I'm guessing this one. Or... There's, like, nothing else around. Oh, a chest. Save the game. And read the little note again. Okay, um... So, procure a welkin stone and return to cloud top to cast a shock spell at the pillar. Okay, I've got a shock spell somewhere. Oh, <laughs> I was struck by lightning and have been granted a powerful new spell. All right, well, that was the most chill uh, lightning strike of all time. <laughs> um, a finger of the mountain. Oh, but I don't have enough magic to use my spell. Hmm. I'm guessing since it's a shock spell, it's a it's a destruction spell. So I gotta, or no, not. I have to just get my magic up in general. Well, next to my level up, we gotta put it on magic. I can do the DLC stuff for Oblivion. Yeah, I want to. I have I have two of the DLCs. I don't remember what they're calling. One's Shimmering Isles, and I don't know the name of the other one. I got them both. They they come with the game, like on Steam, automatically. There's like a buzzing sound, like a cicada or something. It, it's hurting my ear. I don't like this sound. Shivering Isles and Knights of the Nine. Knights of the Nine sounds sick. Wait, I think I have... I think I have that quest if it's a pilgrimage. I'm pretty sure... I, I didn't know that was a DLC. I thought that was just a regular quest. Do I need this cicada sound to go away? It's actually hurting my ears. <laughs> Damn, I didn't know if that was a DLC quest. I thought that was just like a main game quest. Okay, the cicada stopped, thank god. <laughs> what if that was just my ears buzzing after getting hit by lightning? Bye, sad pitch. I uh, will level am I? Um, 21. A 200 magic? How much is the spell? I thought that was... That's not the right one. One f Wait, no. Never mind. Oh! Is that how much... Oh my god. I'm never gonna be able to use that spell. <laughs> I'm never gonna be able to use that. I was like 140. I have 140 magic, but never mind. This is the number. I am never in my life gonna be able to use that spell. The DLCs for this game aren't something you have to finish the main quest for. Yeah, on Skyrim it was the same. You could you could do them at any point too. And the cicada's back. The RuneScape event is over. Thank you, anyone who came in the stream. Thank you for hosting that, Bill. I'm sorry I couldn't make it this time. Next event, I will make it. I promise. Especially if it's like just an hour earlier. <laughs> just so slightly earlier in the day. I could make it. Or later. Later works too.
Alright, we gotta go to the next city so I can get my mage quest. Okay, so... What's the next city? It's Skingrad, did Anvil. Coral. I guess Bruma is the next one on the road, so we'll go to Bruma. I don't fucking like Bruma. Oops. My one and only time going to Bruma, I got instantly arrested. <laughs> Alright, northeast. I guess we're actually going this way. Well, let's wait till morning. What's your star sign? Like, in-game? Like, the one I chose in-game? I actually don't remember, like, what I chose. It was, like, the one that it gives you, like, a... It chooses the alt, I think. I don't remember which one I chose. You can check. You got the ritual. Is that what it's called? Oh yeah, the ritual. Um. Oh, yeah, that, that's my ult that heals my health. I actually think that's a pretty good choice. I don't know what the other ones were. I don't remember what the other options were, but the... That being able to full heal once a day is really nice. <laughs> oh, nice! One of the worst ones! Okay. <laughs> I'm sitting here talking it up. I like it. I like that I get to full heal. Like, I, I need that sometimes. That shit saves my life. That shit has absolutely saved my life multiple times. Oh, fuck. That's a bear over there. I'm going around. Isn't Bruma the town of the Skyrim people? Um... I don't know. Maybe it is. It is far north. Near the border or whatever. Shit. I guess this one looks different. It's a Minotaur... Min Minotaur Lord! I don't like this guy. This guy is scary. Oh, I just blocked his punch. That was badass of me, to be honest. Ow. <laughs> I gotta heal. Got a fucking hero out here. Is this a bandit? It's a bandit! You guys are gonna kill me! <laughs> it's like I always think someone out here is my hero. Just stepping up, come save me. And then they turn around and betray me. What the fuck? They're just saying mean things to me. What the fuck? Why are you fighting me now? I pissed off my own buddy by accident! <laughs> I fucked up. I'm using a poison, I think. Good work. Hmm. Ah, too heavy. Can't take the glass war hammer. I guess I'll leave it. Such a nice day in oblivion on a cloud in the sky. It's a really nice day. You know, even though there's like minotaurs running rampant. Rampant and bandits and whatever. It's still it's a nice world out here Feels good to be outside out here
Alright, we're still trying to head northeast. Why are minotaurs running in the forest? I assumed they came from the the portals, but no. Yeah, I gotta level up, but I don't have a bed anywhere. They gotta get their cardio in too. That's true. <laughs> yeah, they you know they have a right to be out here in nature. Blocking the fuck out of his attacks. I felt good. Hey, a little lake. I might find some Nern root here. It's like a cute little spot for a little waterfall. Hmm. Wait, I let them to the cities? The Minotaurs? I don't know if I'd say I did it. The Minotaurs just kind of showed up one day. Damn, not a single nerd root. Unlucky. Hmm, I gotta go north, but I don't think I- the mountain's like too steep to climb here. Or maybe not? I guess I could just walk right up it. Like a mountain goat. I think that's too steep, but I'll try. What's my acrobatics level? Uh... Like athletics? 47. Oh wait, no, acrobatics. 49. up this. Too steep. We'll go around. What's up, Weston? Hi, Ty. Hello, hello. Right. Well, I guess we'll just follow the path. I feel like I get attacked more on the path than off the path. Two ogres. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't know if I win this fight, like, actually. Whoa! Holy shit. tough bastards yeah they're they hit hard they like when they like slam their fist down they stagger me and i can't move and they punch me like four more times before i could do anything about it Oh 
my god, and they can heal up somehow. I don't know how the fuck they're healing. They shouldn't know magic, they're ogres. <laughs> I die. No, please. Oh, fuck, dude. I'm faster, but I'm not. I'm not faster at all. <gasps> I'm stuck on a rock. Oh, fuck. This is true Oblivion gameplay. <laughs> it's me running for my life horribly. I don't even think this will help me at all. They get confused around these rocks. This is good, actually. Oh my god, he's so low. <laughs> Just fucking <laughs> trying to get him stuck on the rock. Just absolutely cheesing the fight right now. Oh my god. Uh oh. It's not working. I gotta I gotta use my ult. <laughs> uh, I don't even know where it is. I'm panicking. Okay, this one's almost dead. <gasps> yes, we got one, we got one, we got one, we got one. This is doable. This one's almost dead too, kind of. <laughs> and there's a guard! The guard's gonna help! He's gonna save us! <laughs> I don't know if that's very true. I don't think a mud crab has anything on a fucking ogre. Where'd you get all that health from? Um, I have like a... My... My star sign thing... Let's me heal myself to full once a day. So I gotta use it very carefully and that, you know, that's... I felt like that was right. That was the right time. Whew, that was a tough fight. Like, actually... I wonder... I wonder if my armor's broken. It is. You know, that makes sense. I was getting hit so hard. There we go. Um. Oh shit. Restore health. Let's go. Hmm. I can 
very random potions right now. Very satisfying armor repair sound. It is pretty satisfying. I wish I didn't have to repair my armor as much as I do. I feel like I have to repair it an absurd amount. Like after every fight, I don't do it after every fight. I forget a lot, but I feel like I should be doing it after every fight. Alright, well, this is kind of a detour, but let's explore this place. I'm intrigued. Let's try to see what's in there. Hmm. It was a bucket. Good morning. Actually have a lock pick. We could try and unlock that gate. No, apparently I'm in Oh, there's a fucking What is that? Is that an ogre? That looks like a mega ogre. He sounds way scarier than a regular one. <laughs> Maybe I liked it this gate is locked. <laughs> it's probably better this way. Is glowing? I think that's a wisp also. Uh, my current quest is to enter the Mage's Guild and get all my guild recommendations, but, um, I'm exploring right now. Doing some exploring detours. I hear a lot of scary sounds. It's a... Soul gem. Oh, man. Wait, this gate is opened remotely. Oh. Okay. Procrastinate moment. Well, I wouldn't call it procrastinating. I, I am really excited to join the Mages Guild, but, um... You know, you gotta, you gotta explore some ruins from time to time. Oh, fuck, a Minotaur. this game up and make it amazing with all the new tech out there like remake it and maybe maybe they will one day be cool if they actually did I feel like it would be profitable for them to remake it it's like you know they don't have to write a whole new story or anything I don't know why it still has battle music playing it's freaking me out Cough, Skype with you and cough. Isn't that like a like a fan made thing though? From what people in the chat were saying, I haven't looked into it at all, so I don't know for sure. But like, it's not like official Bethesda thing. <laughs> Jesus Christ!
Oh my god, he can't kill me. brutal out here did you beat Skyrim um I did most of the things I wanted to do I guess not everything but you know I did like the main story I did a lot of storylines but definitely not all of them the Bethesda is funding the studio making Sky Oblivion I didn't know that Creepy, creepy place. Can I repair when enemies are nearby, even though I don't see anyone? Don't think so, actually. It's not being funded by them. Do I play RuneScape anymore? I still play. Um, I don't stream it a ton, but I do still play. Hey, Angus, thank you for the six months. Welcome back, dude. Thank you. Um, not funding, it's made by volunteers. That's what I was thinking, like, uh, like fan made. All right, Miranda Eratazza. That's the name of the ruin. Like preemptively using a defense potion. Yep. story to the spooky sub noise um it's a sound bite from dark souls one you can find like these little uh these little like items in dark souls one that say different things and thank you is one of them this place is scary oh it's one of those fucking alien guys ah! and a rat <laughs> What's up, Chrissy? I want to replay this sometime. You should. It holds up really well. I don't even... I don't even... Oh, my fucking god, it's over. Oh, god. I don't even have any mods with it right now. And it's still running well. It does crash sometimes, but... I just save them on him. Okay, I have a feeling... Yep, I was gonna say, I have a feeling that these guys can use doors. <laughs> and they can. Ugh. It's so dark, I can't see. You look like you're fighting the air. When you're fighting one of those like wisp things, you basically are fighting the air. Oh my god. Oh my god. I might have to run out of this fucking ruin. I don't have any health potions or anything. Oh, I don't even know the way out. Ah! Oh, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up. <laughs> I think that guard that was here to come back <laughs> and help me out and be a hero again. Oh. 
just waiting for my magic to regen. Oh, there's the guard! My fucking hero. Holy shit, he's so strong. Wait, no, the ogre's not dead. Well, would have been cool if I swung my sword during that. I thought he was dead. Now he's dead. The guards really do be stepping up. They're great at their job. They're here when I need them most. They really are here when I need them most. Man. I want to keep exploring the ruin, but I'm getting fucked up. I really wish I had more potions. I say that all the time, but I always need more. I just- I always have a ton of potions, but never the right ones. Poison, damage, fatigue, and magic. I keep trying to do something with the flax seeds, but I don't have anything for it. All potion ingredients have poten or have four potential effects. All right, let's go. Might be able to make actually some stuff that I need now. Alright, damage, health, poison. That's pretty good. Another one? Another one? <laughs> this is good. Oh, shield! I like that. I think I might install difficulty smoother mods as a difficulty in oblivion. is the most weird thing that just randomly spikes. Yeah, I've been noticing that in my playthrough, and a few people in the chat have mentioned that the difficulty scale's weird, and I've definitely noticed. Like, right now, these ogres. These ogres are destroying me. Whereas, just a little bit ago, I was kind of... I was breezing through everything. But my... I guess my sword is not repaired right now, and I can't repair it myself. So I'm doing half damage, I think. Or maybe not half. I don't know how that scales. I guess I could use the mace instead. So let's go back in there. Explore a little bit more. Owens took a journal and wrote all the alchemical ingredients and their effects on Oblivion. I was ready to, to brew. Damn. I like that dedication. Alright, we're gonna have to fight that alien guy up here. But I think I think we'll be okay. Oh, he's like already almost dead! I guess we're fucking him up. I didn't even know. Woohoo! Okay. Ooh. Fucking love these things. Love these things. I don't even know where to aim. <laughs> Just floating. Aw. I don't have enough soul gems. I'm debating in my head whether to play Morrowind or wait for Skywind. Are they re redoing Morrowind as well? I don't know that. Or like fan made redoing it. Oh, there's a fucking ogre over there. 
I'm definitely when I when I get to Morrowind, I definitely want to play like the old version. Get to see where it all started. Well, not where it all started, but you know what I mean. The older versions of the games. Original versions, that's what I'm trying to say. every time. I assume you played Skyrim. Yeah, I played Skyrim just before Oblivion. Like, uh, last month was my month with Skyrim. I played it for the first time. And I really liked it. I liked it more than I thought I was going to. Because I, I didn't know I'd like the Elder Scrolls series. Otherwise, I probably would have started with the older ones. But we're, we're working backwards instead. Since I, wow, I just got a lot of money. I started with the newest one. Silence Potion and Shield Ring. I actually really like this ring. I want to wear it. Elder Scrolls is really where Bethesda used to shine. Their world building is phenomenal. Yeah, that's been my favorite thing is the world building. I love the books in game. I, I like reading all of them. Which is a it's just a testament to how interesting they make them because I don't normally read like I don't read books in in real life just my little video game books granted they are very short in games so it makes it easier Fucking this guy up. Okay, I'm getting fucked up now. <laughs> Magic healing potions, I guess I did. Oh. Oh. <sighs> um, how many hours in am I into oblivion? Um, honestly, quite a bit. I'm like 30 hours in, it doesn't feel like it at all. I feel like I'm... I feel like I'm 10 hours in. I feel like I have world knowledge of like 10 hours. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know if that makes sense. And Niccolo, thank you for the thousand bits. You're doing great, thank you. Thanks, Niccolo. Skyrim or Oblivion so far? I mean, I love both. I really do love both. I like the combat better in Oblivion. The combat is very, like, fluid. I thought that was a door. <laughs> the combat feels very fluid and, like, just lightweight in this game and in a good way. In Skyrim, the, the combat felt more realistic, which is not bad. Um, but I, I like it better in, in this game. No pausing like Skyrim. Well, I, it, I definitely do pause the combat in this game. Like, when I drink a potion and stuff, I'm pausing. But not as much, because in Skyrim, I would have to pause even to use my... Use a spell. I'd have to, you know, like, unequip my sword to equip a spell. And that was annoying. I like that in this game, you get to use magic and melee at the same time. It's actually so satisfying. I 
I like swinging a sword 20 times a second. Yep, I really do. I do wonder if that's, uh, like the frame rate thing, even though I tried changing the frame rate like people in the chat said to, but didn't let me. Because, um, I have to play in windowed for OBS to capture it. Fuck, we're in combat again. I don't know with who. Oh! This guy came out of nowhere. <laughs> I'm glad whatever the Dremor is doing is making the Minotaur glow, because it's very hard to oh. see. Oh. Oh. I think it's making himself glow. change in the I and I file unfortunately oh I thought it was a uh, I thought it was just a launcher setting oh I'm over encumbered what did I pick up oh I picked up the horn oh make a potion out of it instead of dropping it Oblivion is more realistic when that of Skyrim's was created due to flashy effects in the show. Uh, I don't know. I feel like the Skyrim combat felt more realistic so it was like slower. But again, that could be a frame rate thing. Uh, it was like slower and clunkier, which like I feel like is more realistic. Like I'm not swinging my sword like a maniac like I am in this game. Uh, and jumping so high with my full set of metal ebony armor. Oh my fucking god. <gasps> I didn't realize I was falling. Safe spawning him. shake makes melee not fun in Skyrim. I get that. I also not a fan of my camera shaking around like that. I definitely got used to it though. light bulbs in this in this ancient ruin. So many of these to repair things. Holy shit, I only have one left. Yeah. Hey, Anon, thanks for the sub to Canadian. Thank you, thank you. Nice to see a fellow Canadian, even though I don't live in Canada anymore. But maybe one day. Oh man, 
really never stop coming in this place. I feel like I should leave and repair my stuff, like my weapons. But... I'm already so far into the ruin. It's like now you said that the streams are a secret can to move. Did I say twice? No, there's no secret Canada move. I kind of wish, though. I honestly don't think I'll be living in Canada for a pretty, pretty long time, if ever. I've kind of accepted I'm probably going to be living in Vegas for a while. That's what someone planning a secret Canada move would say. True. That's a good point. No, I'll probably be in Vegas for quite a few more years. I do really miss Canada. The real move would be going back to Texas. I mean, I only lived in Texas for like four months. I barely, and it was during COVID, like during the, um, I guess it maybe wasn't during like the height of the pandemic, but it was definitely during the really lockdown heavy parts. My, my experience in Texas was not great, but I wasn't there long, like I said. Like I could, we couldn't do anything when me and Jimmy lived there because of like lockdowns and everything. I don't know about this Texas arc. Um, yeah, Jimmy lived there for like a year, I think, and I lived with him for four months out of that year. I'm trying to leave this cave, this ruin. I need to repair my stuff. What made your Texas experience bad? Well, it's just that it was like during COVID when there was still lockdowns, like we couldn't do anything when we lived there. I could leave the apartment, really. There's nothing nothing to do. It's kind of boring. I think we just didn't get to experience, like, anything related to where we lived. So. It was just not... Not much to do. Hi, Fox. Can I spoil something about Oblivion for you? Uh, it's about how the game deals with levels. Um, Ooh, it's leveled up. No, no spoilers, please. I know the scaling's not good, though. If that if that's what you're gonna say, or maybe not that it's not good, but it's weird. That was it. Oh, that's not much of a spoiler. That's okay. Yeah, honestly, I feel like the reason the enemies are so tough right now for me is, I think I've just not been choosing the best stats like when I level up I really I have a hard time sticking to a build that's like a problem for me just in general I'm very I want to be able to do everything you know like I want to <laughs> I want to be able to wear light armor if I want to or heavy armor or or swords or battle axes or just straight up magic like I want to do everything and I feel like this game doesn't want you to do everything I feel like it really wants you to focus up and I'm not good at doing that So I, I've been distributing my stat points pretty pretty evenly, which I think is not ideal. Dude, I don't know where the town is. I'm going the wrong way. Skyrim spoiled you? Yeah, I felt like on Skyrim I really could be anything. Like I could use whatever weapon and style I wanted interchangeably. So yeah, I, I did go into this expecting it to be more like that, and it's not. And that's okay, I don't think it's bad that it's not like that. I just definitely fucked up with my stat distribution. Can I climb this mountain? Nope. Uh. Ow. I punished for trying. Uh. Oh, 
part of it is the leveling. Part of it is that Oblivion non-human enemies are way harder than human enemies. I'll beat up a whole cave of bandits and a single zombie beats my ass. Honestly, I mean, that does make sense. That a... Like a creature would be stronger than, than a human. I feel like I should have stuck to the path right now. Actually, maybe not. I... Climb the mountain. Battle music. Ooh, a chest. Who the fuck am I in combat with? Oh, I just saw something. Nope, that was a leaf. <laughs> And keep on moving. Just ignore the, the scary battle music. It's a very beautiful. Oh, I see a minotaur. Does he see me? I think he sees me. Yep, he sees me. is still insinuating that I'm in combat, but I actually don't know with, with what. It's like making me nervous. It makes me feel like there's a dragon. Oh, we might be close to the town at least. What's up, sniping? It's a bunch of butterflies around. Kill them. <laughs> Oh, that's what this game is missing. Be being able to just, like, swipe the, the butterflies out of the air like you could at Skyrim. That's one thing that's pretty different. Okay. Um, this, the path I'm on right now is not on the map. But we are close to the city. Oh yeah, true no Serana in this game. No companions at all, it seems. Well, I guess you get a companion during like a quest, like when I was escorting Martin to safety. It was, it was fucking shit up. First person, three and four Elder Scroll games really want to keep the core elements of an RPG. I like that. I like the RPG stuff. I'm just a very indecisive person. I can't decide on my build. I right, Oyster, will I be playing Morrowind after this? Yeah! I'm super excited for Morrowind. But I'm probably gonna play Elden Ring first. Like, I think we're gonna do Elden Ring after Oblivion, just because the DLC is coming out. I do really want to play it, and then after Elden Ring, we'll play Morrowind. I'm really excited for Morrowind, though. I, I really want to play it like immediately after, but you know the DLC. I've seen a massive overhaul mod for 4K looks. I like the graphics. 
in in this game in Skyrim. I don't know what Morrowind looks like. Oh, we're finally back in Bruma. I did nothing last time I was in Bruma because I got arrested first first second I stepped into the town and I got mad <laughs> and then I left. But <laughs> now I'll actually I'll actually yes? do some business, do some quests. There's a shopkeeper Go ahead, here. Please. Have a look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to suit you. I'm gonna sell these robes. I'm not gonna deal. use them. Um. That seems a fair. That's a good deal. That. I played Morrowind for the first time and I needed to mod to increase the view distance. It was unplayable for me unmodded. Is it really is it really short? Like short view distance? I guess that would be pretty annoying. Have I done any guild quests? Um, I joined the Thieves Guild, but I haven't like done anything. Actually, I'm in Bruma right now, so my Thieves Guild quest is I just need to steal things and sell it in Bruma, so I guess I'll I guess I'll be committing some crimes while we're here. Um, but right now I'm trying to do my mage guild quest where I just have to, um, holy fuck, I have a lot of these, I need to sell some, they're really An heavy. Excellent. Uh, I need to do a quest for every mage guild in every town so that I get my recommendations, they officially let me in as a member. So that's why we're in Bruma now to get my mage guild quest. But I want to do my thieves guild thing too while we're here. I just gotta go steal Come. some stuff. I'm not very good at stealing, though, but we'll try our best. Is this a blacksmith? Kinda seems so. Skjorda, Nordwinds. We clothes and armor. Hey, maybe you this one. Yes. Yes. Can't I need my sword repaired finally. What can I interest you in? Holy shit, look at this armor. Dondoran's Juggernaut. 11,000 gold. You know, I've got 1,000. We're, we're, we're getting there. Just spent 10% of it, though. Thank you. You too. Hey, what's up, Weed? How's it going? It's going, it's going pretty good. How are you doing, Weed? Man, these shopkeepers are following me. I think I'm suspicious. Hmm. I gotta find the Mages Guild. They don't know how bad of a thief you are. <laughs> yeah, they really don't need to follow me. I'll make a ton of noise regardless. <clears throat> Whoa. Uh, any luck finding Jaskar? Oh, dear. did I already get my quest Once here? Once I can see Jaskar again, I'd be more than happy to write a recommendation I forgot that I grabbed you. this quest. I guess I grabbed it last time I was here. And then I left really quickly because I got mad that they arrested me. Okay, I've got to find a guy named Jaskar. Please come find me as soon as you've located Jaskar. <clears throat> Hi, Mason. Well met. What can I interest you in? Hmm. Ooh, wait. Never mind. I want. The, I want the spell. I can't afford it, and I don't have a high enough magic level for it anyway. Hmm. Guess I'll be buying Take nothing. Care. It'd be fucked up for me to steal from the Mages Guild, the place where I live. I think I'm, I might have to. I don't even know if he 
it counts as stealing. I think I'm actually allowed to... Ooh, a recipe. Oh. Get some mushrooms. Yeah, I don't know if this is actually stealing. I think I might just be allowed to take this stuff. Let's see. It always says if it's stolen. Yeah, I think I could just take this. I'm actually not stealing right now. This is just for me. Yep, nothing says it's stolen. That's good normally, but <laughs> I do need to steal for my, my quest. Oh, well, I guess we'll go steal somewhere else. Oh, I should probably sleep and level up. Hmm. Okay, so intelligence, willpower, and speed this time. I'm... I know I was just talking about how I keep choosing like a balanced build. I know that it's bad, but I can't stop. I'm, I've just accepted I'm gonna you know, have a terrible build. I love that little guy. Well met. Best Leaf tries to steal free stuff. <laughs> Alright. Let's see. Can I go? Can I go upstairs here? <gasps> he doesn't see me. Fuck. What? <laughs> I'm struggling. Oh my god, I'm getting in my head about it. I thought it was gonna be one of those doors you load into. This is not what I wanted. Nicola, thank you for the bits. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I feel like I'm in a I'm in a staring contest with this guy. I can't back down right now. He's wondering how that door magically opened. It's super fucking weird that that happened. Crazy, right? It's so crazy. I'm gonna close it. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> Good Nothing weird. Let's hear it. I have like no lock fix left though. So <laughs> just steal from someone who doesn't lock their doors. Yeah, I, I took one item. I took a cup, and that's it. <laughs> By what right Greetings, do you disturb Breton. me? What? Isn't Sirok an excellent healer? A good healer makes for a happy town, and Sirok almost seems like another Nord to me. Okay, uh -huh. I guess. They're really, really struggling with uh, stuff to steal. Whoa! <gasps> what do you think you're doing? I forgot you could pickpocket in this game. What do you want, trash? Oh, now everyone's mad at me. Hello. I forgot you could pickpocket in this game. I was trying to open the door or talk to him, and I was in his pocket. Am I? I'm about to get arrested. Aren't it's all I? over, lawbreaker. I didn't even fucking Your take anything. I misclicked. I'll take any stolen goods you have. The I didn't next even move... take anything. That's too bad. Okay, here's the procedure. My spree of misclicking is over. I'm Tolgan. Oh, what the hell? Herald to Countess Narina Carvain here in Bruma. She requests your company at your earliest convenience. Well, I'm gonna get it executed now. <laughs> Countess Carbane I'm getting executed for stealing. In person. She also said to present you with this stipend as a taste of things to come. My lady holds court from eight in the morning until six in the hey, evening. Hey, donkey, thank you for day. the seven months. That would be the best time to see her. I'm just kidding. This is actually good. Oh, I just got my money back. 
for my bounty. <laughs> Misclicking right. Tell it to the judge. <laughs> Tell me more about this countess. The countess is in attendance from eight. If you wish to seek audience with her, please return at that time. Okay, but why does she want to see me? What time is it right now? Is it okay that I go to the Great Hall, like, naked? Is she gonna be mad? Oh, hello. Well met, milady. It's a pleasure to see you. I've heard much about your deeds from my people in Bruma. I trust the stipend Tolgan gave you whetted your appetite. The 25 gold, <laughs> yup. <Good point. laughs> Allow me to formally introduce myself. I'm Countess Narina Cavain. I assume you've noticed all the Akaviri relics I'm displaying. I didn't even get to see them. Well, it's safe to say I'm a collector of sorts. I've invested a great deal of time and money acquiring these bits of ancient history. But if she's also in a fact, thief. I'd be so bold as to proclaim my collection the most complete in all Cyrodiil, perhaps even beyond. Except for one thing. A particular relic has eluded me for steal many years. Steal her artifacts. Possessing this piece of Akaviri antiquity <laughs> would, would definitely make get my executed for that. Complete. I'm of course referring to the Draconian Madstone. Ooh. Tell me more. The stone is a fine bit of Akaviri craftsmanship. Worn like an amulet, this talisman is said to protect the wearer from poisons of any type. That's pretty sick. The madstone appears as a snake coiled around and encircling itself. The eyes of the snake are supposed want this thing to be for precious myself. gems or some such. Through my sources, I've learned that the last reported location of the Madstone was the ruins at Pale Pass. Pale Pass? I don't think I've been there. Are you familiar with the history of Pale Pass? No. Back at the end of the First Era, raiders from the continent of Akavir like nice attempted lesson. to gain a foothold here in Tamriel. At that time, the Empire was broken into smaller factions. Raymond Cyrodiil decided to unify them and form an army to repel the Akaviri raiders. The force became known as the Army of Raymond. The two armies clashed in what's now northern Cyrodiil. The Akaviri were strong and well supplied. But their greatest error was marching through Morrowind on the way to their objective and it's dismissing so the response it would garner from Vivek. <laughs> I'm like trying they to didn't actually count listen on Lord but I <laughs> forming an alliance with the trident kings of the Dread. From Morrowind, he struck at their rear flank. Vivek. Not only did this make the Why do I know that name? fight on Vivek. two fronts, it something. also cut off access to reinforcements and supplies from the sea. <laughs> History lessons are boring. <laughs> um hmm. You must be joking, Tell right? Tell me more about Ra Who hasn't Raymond. heard of the greatest Raymond. known hero of the First Age? I've heard of him, Raymond but I don't know Cyrodiil much about him. Not only was the conqueror of the Akaviri forces, but he actually convinced them to help build the Empire as it is today. With such an empire at his disposal, he conquered most of Tamriel, except Morrowind, of course, and was crowned Emperor. Damn. In fact, he instituted the rites of becoming an Emperor which included the construction of the Amulet of Kings. His alliance with Lord Vivek during the Akaviri invasion is just one example of his cunning and ingenuity. Damn. Vivek's a popular guy. Not quite. The army of Raymond knew that where the organized Akaviri forces I've, were commanded from the mountains. I don't know if I heard in Skyrim or if I'm like mixing up memories from Rumors the start of this game. Rumors snowy vale called Pale Pass. That's where Raymond focused his attention. As his forces fought their way across the Gerald Mountains, the Akaviri suddenly surrendered. It was assumed they were overwhelmed and gave up. The only strange part was that the command post and Pale Pass were never found. It was dismissed as a rumor, and the army of Raymond celebrated. It's come to my attention that the post did exist, 
and it happens to be the last reported location of the draconian madstone. I gotta get this fucking madstone. <laughs> You'll see in Morrowind. Maybe that's where I heard the name, because when I played Skyrim, I read the, like, the History of Morrowind book. I read one of them. I didn't read all of them. There's, like, I think there's a couple of them. Or maybe the one that they have is really long, but maybe that's where I saw the name. Well, I guess we're going to ooh, buy a house I don't for how trust much? you enough to talk about that. I have to be trusted to buy a house? That doesn't seem fair. Please consider my proposal. I think everyone has a right to owning a home. Everyone should have a right to land if they can afford it. Hello. Or I just in general, to be honest, but... Other fighting guild members. Hear me it's out like before that. you make your decision. <laughs> That's so fucked up. Please consider my proposal. Well I'm considering it. I'm gonna... Well met, milady. I wanna find that amulet. Or not... Yeah. Well, amulet, madstone. Not you, you're a criminal scum. Wasn't that why she just recruited me for her little quest? Because I am a criminal? She thinks it's cool and badass that I steal. Hail. Hmm. I think it'd be really bad if I stole from the church. Just a little bit of praying. Welcome, pilgrim. I feel like I'm moving so fast right now that I took my armor off. It's like actually kind of freaking me out how quickly I'm moving. A human being should never be this fast. Holy shit, they got ghosts down here! Wait, they don't see me though. Never mind, they do see me. Are they friendly? Are they actually friendly? Wait, they're chill ghosts. That's creepy as fuck, but I, you know, that's fine, I guess. Damn, they chill as fuck. I've never met a ghost this chill before. He's just vibing. <laughs> I respect that. Let me take, let me take a picture of him. Nice, looks good. He just wants a hug. <laughs> Oh, offering box. This is some shit I'll get in trouble for. But there's nothing in it. Maybe I'm supposed to make an offering. How do I put money? How do you put money into something? Wait. No, I don't know how. I'll put... I'll put... Um... I'll put a lotus in since there's a lotus on the table. I think I have one. Wait, that's just a seed. Okay, well, I'll take the lotus and I'll put it in. But that's still just a seed. I don't know how to harvest a fucking flower. There you go. That's my offering, I guess. Hopefully the ghosts are cool with that. I hate League so much, but I keep playing. I need a lobotomy. Damn, I didn't know you played League of Legends, Marley. I could never get into that game. I think I, I'm just not a big MOBA enjoyer. Ghosts are like, you cheap ass and attack you. Hey, I, I wanted to put money in, but apparently you can't. Well, it's crazy that ghosts are real. Oh. She's going to the ghosts? What the fuck is she doing here? Greetings to you. The Nine welcome you to Bruma. I'm Isa Raymond, priest. She's not gonna say anything with the in the ghosts. Good day. Well met. What can I interest you in? She sells. She sells some stuff. 
heal a legendary wound. Fuck, I can't afford that. Can't afford that one either. Okay. She looks creepier than the ghost. <laughs> That's why she's not scared of him. Did I play the Fallout series? No. I want to, though. Skyrim was my, my introduction to Bethesda games. Look at the muscles on you. Oh my god, she's flirting with me. <laughs> Am I allowed to pickpocket in a chapel? I'm gonna try. <gasps> Gurge! Oh! Gurge a pickpocket here. No! <laughs> I've never pickpocketed before. I'm not really good at it. I gotta get out of here. I don't know how I got caught. He, I was... I don't know. <laughs> I was sneaking. <laughs> You're going to hell. <laughs> oh, I fucked up. Oh, I fucked up. Greetings to you. Uh-oh. I don't think I can. I, I have to surrender. Stop right there, criminal scum. <laughs> That's too bad. Okay. I pay my bounty. Sad. I tried. I'm just trying to rank up in the Thieves Guild, you know? It's actually really hard to steal right now. I'm having a hard time. Everyone's like guarding their shit pretty well. You know, maybe the torch is drawing attention to me. I didn't even think of that. God. Can they see me? I can't tell. The eyeball's not really... ...doing much. Nice! I took one thing! I did it! I got one. <laughs> I got one. I wonder why the Countess doesn't trust you. But she likes that I'm a thief. I think that's why she recruited me. Okay, I need to find who I'm supposed to sell things to in Bruma. For... Ongar the Fence. It's somewhere here in Bruma. I just have to find him. Hi! Have we done Shivering Isles yet? Mm -mm. How do you do? Nope. Greetings, Breton. I think it's in this building. Evening. How goes it? Wait, this is the guy. I see you are with the Gray Fox. I am. You got some hot property. I'll sell my stolen one thing. I think my I can one move stolen this thing. item for you at that price. Got anything else? <laughs> the worst fucking thief, dude. I need I need to sell fifty gold worth of things to him to rank up. I'm, I can't. Oh, lockpicks though. I'm glad. <laughs> One down, forty nine to go. Shadow. How hiding. about that? All right. Greetings. Where can I steal? What is it? Hmm. What's this about? Any back door entrances? Oh, they actually do. Holy shit. I'm breaking into this guy's basement. It's probably going to take me quite a few attempts. I'm going to try it. No. Come on. Clicking too early. <laughs> okay. Oh! I did it. Oh, this thing looks expensive. Ceramic urn. Some plates. Cup. Some shoes. I think those, half of these things are actually worth nothing at all. I fucked up. 
<laughs> Value zero. <laughs> yeah, I noticed that <laughs> a little bit late. All right. Well, I made some... You know, it's hard to judge the value of something just by looking at it. Oh, no. no! <gasps> My lockpicks! Oh, no. Nope, I got him. Never mind. Crisis averted. Dude, where's all the where's all the wealth, all the riches? This stuff is not worth much at all. Just gonna <laughs> gonna loudly repair my armor while I'm in the middle of stealing. Fuck, over encumbered. Okay, I got some I got some good stuff. I think I could sell. Where's all your armor? I'm just not wearing it right now because it's it's too clunky. It makes too much noise when I'm trying to steal. Hey. Hey. I'm really tired. You got some hot property. Buy my stuff. I stole so much stuff. I think I can. Did I even steal? I don't even remember. None of this has the stolen symbol. I think I can move this item for you at that price. Got oh, anything I else? Wine. I stole wine. You got a, a fine transaction. Uh, Shadow hide you. I don't even know if that counted towards my quest because talking about the hero of I don't think that counted as stealing. I think I was just taking it for free. It didn't count. What the fuck? Well, I'm not sneaking anymore then, I guess. This is probably where it counts as stealing inside here. Please don't let someone be in here. Okay, is this stolen? It's still not stolen. Well, am I just allowed to be in here? This guy seems pretty chill huh? about it. You're not Grom. Get out of my home. What if I don't want to leave? He does I mean, he told me to get out, but he doesn't, like, actually seem to care too much. Even- I'm even allowed to sleep in his bed. Hmm. I'll take a little nap. So I leveled up. He's not chill anymore. He's scared out of his mind. <laughs> That's why he's not telling me to get out. <laughs> well, I guess I live here now. It's, it's really not putting up much of a fight at all. Huh? I have to pick the lock to get out. Hmm. Stealing is harder than I thought. Everyone just wants to give me all their stuff away. What? Good day. Am I allowed to be in here? Thief! 
You won't get away with this. <gasps> I will get away with it. I will get away with it. <gasps> I mean, uh, <laughs> I was gonna try and sell it. <laughs> That's too. Oh. I was gonna try and sell it before they could take it away from me. <laughs> Man, this thieving thing ain't easy. Being a criminal is really hard. I don't know if this is the the path for me. I mean, it does, at this point, it doesn't matter. This is the path I've chosen, but god damn, it's not easy. I feel like I'm better off going to a different city, stealing shit, and then coming back. What? Stealing and um, breaking into the shop. This is the move. This is the move. <gasps> okay. What the fuck is all this stuff? Okay, fuck. I don't have room for like a lot of the really heavy stuff. Big ticket items are too heavy to steal. Hmm. <gasps> okay. I think you're made for this life, for the life of crime. <laughs> I'm really doing my best to, like, fit into it, but it's fucking hard. Let's make a potion with some of my heavy stuff. Alright, I think we can sell this stuff. I think I did good. Why is your character naked? Because it makes it easier to steal. What's this about? How are you? Oh, oh my gosh, he, he's about to steal. How goes it? Oh my god, I'm watching a pro. Put that back, you worthless hey. thief. What's going on with you? <laughs> I ran into a couple of mud crabs. Well, I'll see, it's not <laughs> it's not just me that struggles. This guy's supposed to be a fucking pro and he couldn't get away with it. What is it now? <laughs> I'm really tired. You got some hot property. It's not just me, at least. This is what I I'm supposed I, to be learning from. I think I can move this item for you at that price. Got any? There that's go. more. That's more than I. I'm glad. Well, hey, I should. Shut I should rank up now. Hide you. I've reached my goal. I've fenced over fifty gold worth of goods. I should go see Armin sometime. He might have something for me. Good day. Nice. <gasps> conjuring up dead. You hear about Jorund? Is he about to arrest him? And now he's in jail. I bet our Nora's beside herself with nope. grief. Just came in to stare at me, I guess. <coughs> Safe travels. Bye. Evening. He's doing it again. This you guy sucks at stealing. How Hello. dare you steal from me? <laughs> I've been better. How about you? Yo, he yelled at him. He's pissed off. He's going to his room now. <laughs> is there a better person to learn heavy armor? And Bruma crazy today. This town is insane. All right, but I did my my little thief skilled thing. That's good. Now I have to do my mage skilled thing. How does it feel knowing like I'm a better thief than you? <laughs> Listen, I'm I'm moving I'm moving up. I'm ranking up. I'm gonna steal again just for fun. I don't even have to steal right now, but. I'm just gonna do it to prove I can. What do I want to take? Taking the bow for no reason other than I want it. Yep, that's all I wanted. Stealing for fun. I'm gonna go sell it right away, though. I don't want to walk around stolen goods. Hello. 
I'm really tired. You got some this hot guy's property? always tired. I think I think I can move this item for you at that price. Nice. Um, shadow hide you. I feel like I actually am getting better at stealing. Hi there. I expected you to fail that. As long as as long as I don't have armor on, as long as I'm naked, stealing is not Good so evening. bad. Right, where's my mage guild quest? I do want to do the... I want to do the quest for the Jarl, or the Countess, or whatever. Um, but I need to do my mage guild recommendation first. Not that one. I'm gonna find someone named Jaskar. Right, where's the mage guild? Here. Look at the muscles on you. <laughs> Everyone's in awe of my muscles today. This is awesome. Good evening. I've been climbing mountains and shit. I guess do? I'm getting muscular. Greetings. It's like I take my armor off and suddenly everyone's really nice to me. Being a house would be pretty goaded. I wish I could, but the fucking Jarl or Countess doesn't trust me enough to sell me a house. Which sounds like it should be illegal. You can just decide not to let someone have a house in the city, I think. Good day. Tell me about Jaskar. You want to find Jaskar? All right, I think I can help with that. But you have to agree to do something for me first. What is this, one and small favor? You, do, you can't tell Jean about it, all right? <laughs> okay. That's the spirit. You help me pull off a little prank, and I'll help you find Jaskar. Right. <laughs> really? You're going to love this. I'll teach you a spell to unlock things. What Ooh. you need to do is get into Jean's desk and bring me her manual Ooh, spell card. I've, okay? I'm primed for this quest right now. I've been her stealing. I'm upstairs. warmed up. Make sure no one sees you. You do that for me, and I'll make sure you can find Jaskar. I can do that. Let me know when you're done with that little task. Hmm. Do you like Skyrim or Oblivion more? I mean, I, I think I feel like I like them both very similarly, but I like the combat more in Oblivion, and I like the I like the variety of like ruins and things to explore. Um, more in Skyrim. What did he need me to steal? Manual of Spellcraft. I don't even know where I'd find that. Oh, upstairs. Okay. Oh, she's sleeping. Holy shit, I'm getting really good at stealing. She didn't even wake up. Where's this buddy? I just went to bed. <laughs> oh! Pickpocket! I didn't mean to! I didn't mean to! Have you pulled? I was trying to talk to him, I forgot I was sneaking. You've got Jean's <laughs> book, I see. All right then. I'll just take that from you. Meet Hopefully me here he says never place. mind about the pickpocketing thing. Oh, no! <gasps> oh, no. Uh, I don't even know if that's for the pickpocketing thing or if that's for the quest. Yeah, they kicked me out so fast! Is this forever? If that's forever, I would actually maybe reload. Yeah, I can't even make one mistake. They don't they don't believe in forgiveness. I was a misclick. That's a reload angle. I'll pack up your things, you're done. I'm gonna let me see if I can beg. 
Oh, you just go talk to Until then, I'm a- Wait, 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 he's- wait, she said- she told me what to do. I- I misclicked- I didn't hear what she said. Oh, you just go talk to Romanus Polis at the Arcane University, and he'll have things straightened out in no time. Okay. Until then, I'm afraid it wouldn't be an- Romanus Polius or something. Let's see if this- if this fixes anything. Romanus Polius. Yeah, I'm- I'm fast traveling there. We're taking- we're taking a carriage. Raminus Polius. Speak. Well, but there's no one here. For the love of Azura, can't a man have a bit of privacy? Get out of here! Sorry. <laughs> I'm just fucking everything up. They all hate me. Holy shit, where am I? What the fuck? Please let me back in. For the love of Azura, can't a man have a bit of private? I think you should leave. I'm trying. Speak. I don't know where to find this guy. Can I go in here? Time is in game. 6 a.m.? Okay, maybe I gotta wait till like 10. I've noticed things don't open up till like 10 a.m. Oh, come on. <gasps> it is unfortunate Reminous. that we should meet under these circumstances. Please let me back Associate. in. You have been found guilty of theft. I didn't even, I actually didn't even steal. Privileges. Well, I did for the quest, but the pickpocket thing was I didn't take to be anything. Reinstated, you must perform a service for the guild. We can be reinstated. It's not so? over. I don't have to reload. I'll fucking do anything. I'll Very kill anyone. Well. I'll Make anything. No mistake. This task is simple, but has a purpose. In selflessly serving the guild at risk to yourself, while putting your own feelings aside, you prove your devotion to the cause. I'll do it. You will help replenish our chemical supplies for the guild. <laughs> Deliver 20 dragon tongue flowers and 20 red wart flowers to me. They're making Surprise. me grind. Annoyed? It is not unexpected. Nevertheless, I feel like that's that actually a pretty fair <laughs> punishment. <laughs> I feel like that's pretty fair, to be honest. All right, 20. I already forgot what it was. 20 red wart flower and 20 dragon's tongue. I could do it. My favorite, my favorite task, picking flowers. I could fucking do that. I don't, I don't know where to start, to be honest. Let's go down here. Oh! Ow! Do the things I do. The pain I put myself through. Right. Never repent for your crimes. Is, is this fair? It's a fair punishment, honestly. Okay, dragon's tongue. I feel like near skin grad, there's always a lot of flowers. Put on some clothes. <laughs> True. We're gonna get these flowers fair and square. I won't even steal them. The red, the red wart one. I don't really know where, where I get that one. But the dragon's tongue. I know what that one looks like. I've seen that one a million times. Really wish I had some right now. Let's see how much we have. I might have zero dragon's tongue. I don't have any. What if I just go to an alchemy shop and buy them, though? Also, how do I get up here? Oh, never mind. Just walk. 
Never mind, that didn't work. There's someone here. I hear a person talking. I like actually can't get up there. What the hell's with this island? trees there. I thought it'd be a good place to find flowers. I just can't get up at all. It's part of it. the Mage Guild quest line. Can't get to it. Man, it's, it's a hard life that I'm living right now. I don't know where to go find flowers. Very barren landscape here. Very flowerless area. And found a single flower yet. He didn't give you any tips? Nope. I don't think he wants to... You know, he, he thinks I'm scum. He thinks I'm criminal scum. He doesn't want to... He doesn't want to help me. He wants this to be as difficult as possible so I really learn my lesson never to steal again. Need to turn a herb tracking on? Yeah, I need the herb her track and plug in. Hey, I've, I've never been to Chayden Hall yet. I feel like I shouldn't go there right now. I'm gonna get sidetracked. I need, I want to be in the Mages Guild so bad. I have to find these flowers. We can go see if we can buy them. Let's go, let's go to the town real quick. Market district. Maybe, maybe money solves everything, you know? Give us some hobo Sam. Have pity on an old war veteran. Should be in alchemy shop Hello. somewhere. How are you today? Great. There's something strange about Ida Lenorman. I'm still not over how you messed this up terribly. <laughs> yeah, I fucked up horribly. Greetings. This guy got a cool fucking staff. Any friend of the society is a friend of mine. Have a look around. You won't find better prices in all Tamriel. Hmm. None of this is what I need. Oh, dragon, dragon plant. And what was the other one? Something red. Red wart. Fuck. Hello. Imagine getting banished for stealing from someone who told you to go steal something. <laughs> yeah, this, this is fucked up. He should get banished too. We should have to do this quest together, I think. Hi there. I think I'm gonna sell this mace since it's not charged right now. I'm gonna sell it. See anything you like? Can I interest you in some of my wares? Yeah. Carrying too much around right now. An excellent bargain. That's more. Excellent bargain. A pleasure to serve. It's been a pleasure. Now I hope that that quest doesn't bug after being reinstated. Hello there. I think that would destroy me. <laughs> that would destroy me as a person if the quest just broke after I fucking fight and claw my way to make it back in. Alright, we're gonna 
I'm gonna take a little carriage to Skingrad. Like, near Skingrad, there's a fuck ton of flowers. Was this the woman that hated you? Yeah, we've, uh, we've made up. It's also sleep, er, not sleep, I mean, stand still until morning. How are you? Alright, here there's usually a ton of flowers. I'm sure we'll find what we need. Dragon's tongue and red wart something something. I'll look at all those flowers over there. I hope we can find the red one. I don't know if I found that plant before. Okay. Peony. This thing's red. This is flax. It's not what I need. If that guy could just give me a picture of what the plant is, that would really help me out. It's a nice little book with uh, plant identification tips. Tips and tricks. Oh, there's a portal. <gasps> nope, that's still not it. I feel like this quest, just getting these plants, is gonna take me an hour. Give him the plants and pickpocket them back. I'm gonna get banned for life from the Mage Guild. Pilgrimage quest progress. That's good at least. There's strawberries. Do I want you to look up where to find flowers? No, that's okay. We'll find them. Dragon's tongue is a thin single flowers. Yeah, the dragon's tongue is yellow. I know that one. It's like yellowy orange. The red wart one, I mean, I assume it's red, but I don't know if I've even encountered that one, which maybe means I need to travel to some of the towns I haven't been to yet. It's maybe like different plants and different biomes. Usually there's a lot of dragon's tongue around here, I thought. I'm taking any plant at this point, just hoping, hoping it's close to what I need. Very demonic, but very pretty. Oh, dragon's tongue. Never mind. Different plant. Let's go to the town. I think the alchemy shop might have, might have something for me. Mage's Guild plant searching is the harshest punishment in the whole game. Yeah, it's pretty harsh considering I didn't actually steal anything. I misclicked. <laughs> it does not fit the crime. Punishment. I'm gonna check the alchemy shop. They actually, there's there is often a lot of um, dragon's tongue growing in the town too. Hello there. Just tell them that they'll understand. <laughs> There should be like a court thing, like a court hearing. I think this is the alchemy shop. Court hearing a system. To... You never know when you might need a good, strong potion. Best to stock up now while you can. Hey. Okay. Did her flower um stock is not very good. None of this is what I need. Farewell. Let's check. 
these plants. Ginseng. Flax. Okay. Check the people's gardens. Someone's gotta be growing something. Hope you're still having fun. You inspired me to take up Elder Scrolls Online again. Oh, I hope you're having fun with that. I loved Elder Scrolls Online. I've been kind of wanting to play it again. Just since I've been playing the not online Elder Scrolls. I've been fiending for it. Good afternoon. Guys, I may have fucked up greatly by getting in trouble with the Mage's Guild. It's been like 10 minutes I haven't found a single flower that I need. I fucked up horribly. I swear I used to see Dragon's Tongue like everywhere in the city. Oh my god, it's Glarthir. R.I.P. Glarthir. Maybe this will teach you a lesson in committing crimes. Yeah, I gotta get really, really, really good at committing them what instead. Dragon tongue? Yup, it's a plant. You'll know soon enough hacks once you play this game. You'll know all about it. Oh, I broke my legs. They really sentence you to 40 hours of community service. I know. I can't, like, I can't find any flowers right now. My, my life is falling apart. Maybe you need to cut out a real dragon tongue. That'd probably be easier than this. These people aren't planting enough fucking flowers. Maybe I've already harvested like every flower and that's why I can't find them right now. Nice. Well, we're at least making pilgrimage progress. Even though I can't find my my flowers. It's not all for nothing. I really do feel like I must be looking in the- <gasps> Dragon's tongue! This is- I don't want to get my hopes up. <laughs> it's not dragon's tongue. It looks just like dragon's tongue. <gasps> I don't know where to look. I'm fucking calling an Uber right now. We're going to a different town. Going to Anvil. Bet they got flowers here. We checked a dragon's mouth just asking. You know, they I haven't found a dragon yet in this game. <gasps> dragon's tongue! Got one. Now we need 19 more. Maybe they grow near water. We needed 20. Yeah, I fucked up horribly. I I've I committed a crime by accident, I will say. And now they're making me do community service for, for penance, for forgiveness. This was worse than finding the Crimson Nurn Root in Blackreach. I actually didn't mind that quest when I was doing it. What's this guy doing being creepy? What do you want? Talk. Get 
all around for these damn plants. Ooh, Nern Root. Hmm. I do wish that, like, the plants would, um, load in from a further distance. I've never been up here. Oh, shit! Whoa! He choose to steer by the stars of the lady. Sure. Stars of the lady shine upon you. You have gained the lady's warding greater power. Can you ult? That's, I got like an extra ult, I guess. I'll take it. Yeah, I wish the, the flowers loaded in from a greater distance. You have to be like pretty close for for it to actually load in, so I can't even like look in one direction see if there's plants. I just have to go and check and hope. Increase draw distance. I think I'm at the max. The grass distance. I don't know what object fate is. Oh! I think that actually does help. I already forgot how to get there. Item fate as low as possible. It, it sounds like it... I don't know if that makes sense though. If it's items being deleted, I don't know. I won't mess with that one. Okay, maybe now we could see flowers look further. <gasps> oh. Let's fucking scout out the area. Baron out here. What time is it? Just max that shit. The fade thing? I mean, we could try it. Alright. <laughs> I didn't do it all the way because I wasn't sure. I guess do that. I definitely am seeing plants like further out now, which is nice. Okay, well, I think um, I think I'm gonna return to the town and and save the game and call it here for today. Cause I gotta go eat something, but tomorrow I will I will pay my debts to society. I will make peace with the mages guild, and all will be well. I think I really do just have to travel to the different, like, towns, because the... I do think plants are different, different areas, it seems like. But for now, I must eat and rest. Alright. Thank you guys for spending some time with me today. I had a really, really fun time. Um, if you haven't already, you should watch my, my Skyrim video. I would really appreciate it. That's a link to it if you want to see it. Um, and I will be back tomorrow. I'll be live tomorrow like 2 p.m. ish. Around 2 p.m. PST. So I'll see you guys pretty soon. Um... I really have no idea who to host today. Alright, instead of hosting someone, I will spam the link to my video and 
beg that you watch that instead. <laughs> okay, good night, guys. I will see you tomorrow. Bye.